fanatic. We're live. We are live. I don't know what. I don't know who's pressing the buttons around here, but it isn't me. Um, <laughs> it's not me. Darren's <laughs> probably have... pressing the buttons. You know, yeah. I mean, hiding. Darren's here. Obviously, In hiding. Darren's here. Obviously, he's here. He's um. He's not. He says his laptop is low. He's not. Uh. Ad, he didn't hit the add to stream button. That's me. I'm, I'm echoing, guys. Hold on. I lost you. Um, Shadow, I missed what you said. So anyway, guys, we're live. It's J. Mike, Fanatic Guide, Shadow Scout Suite on, on Darren Dobson Live. And uh, Darren is here. And he's just not on screen. And we can't hear him, so he'll be here. He didn't hit the add to stream button, or he did, and it's it's not... It's not... Um, He's not popping up. <laughs> I, don't know. I thought of that, um, bringing the the, um, the co-hosts up and then staying off off screen. That that just occurred to me. You know what? Uh, when we when we get ready to go live, on, when I'm the host, um, I pop you guys in first. Whoever's first, you go in first, and then I'm not there. But I I don't I don't delay in, in I don't go live that way. So you know, one time fanatic, I went live a few days ago, and then I I didn't realize we were live already. <laughs> it's so funny. I went live before I was ready to go live, and then I thought, when you came on, I thought we weren't live. <laughs> so I had a brain freeze. Hey, so Ruby. I have all this, I have all this Good morning. Here, and Good I, see I you. can't eat it because I'm talking. <laughs> I don't know what this is. It's not a mango smoothie. I think it's orange juice. What a surprise. I have orange juice. So anyway, guys, um, what does Darren... Oh, I can't. He didn't give me the... Uh, hey, Darren, if you're in the chat or if you if you're, if you have audio, you could give me the command um, to show chats and stuff like that. Um, assistant General Manager. I don't know what they call it. I, I saw it, but I, I forgot what it's called. You know, just technical mumbo-jumbo is what I call it. <laughs> so... Uh, I'm here in the back with no video. I will reboot. Oh, okay. Then you're gonna. Um, that will not shut us down if it's because it's StreamYard. The StreamYard will hold us for a few minutes. So, uh, Mom, Ruby's here. Ruby, make a love shout out. I'm just gonna talk to the chat for a few minutes, guys. Um, Ruby's here. Uh, Majoy Delo Reyes is here. Chef Hit Dice. Chef Hit Dice. Now, obviously you're a chef, but what does that mean? Hit dice. I'm not sure. Are you are you just um, like when when you roll the dice in 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 a, um, a gambling game in in the craps game dice whatever they call it. Um, you're taking your chances. Right? So if you're a chef, are you just throwing stuff in the pan and taking chances? <laughs> That's the f the funny thing. I, I like to think of funny things like that. So I don't know. Chef hit dice right there, guys. Uh, thanks for stopping in. And uh, you know what we like to do here? We like to connect with with um, new visitors. We like to connect with you guys and, and, and get the... Hey, uh, and my, where's my hey phone? Tammy. Where's my phone? Somebody moved it. Here it is. Give me a second, guys. I got some food retailer from, from the USA, from New England fanatic. Oh. They call me and, and they don't leave messages, but they keep calling me, and I don't answer it. And then it just says missed call. <laughs> it's, it's like I don't know who the heck they are, but I don't block them because they don't bother me. Let's see. Let's, where's YouTube? There it is. Every once in a while, like, my apps move all over the place. So anyway, it looks like Darren's popping in, guys. Hey, I'm re rebooting my laptop. Welcome to the Darren Dobson Show. I, I thought I better come on so it doesn't fully shut down. <laughs> exactly. Now, um, I think somewhere in the um, somewhere I read, I can't remember if it was in Streamyard or or in YouTube, that um, I think Streamyard says that they will keep you live if the host drops out. The StreamYard will keep the show live for a specific amount of time. But right. somebody else, a, another live streamer that we know, uh, said that you'll stay live indefinitely. So I don't know which is which. Don't know. I just know I when I was, when I was, the, my laptop, I shut it down. Because it, it's just black. It just won't pull up the camera, won't pull up the audio. 
too much, but when I reboot it, it resets it. It works perfect. And I, but I already did it once, and I had to do it again. <laughs> like, Sounds like a registry problem or some some technical mumbo jumbo problem. So, so, <laughs> so at least I'd use my phone to like reboot my laptop again. <laughs> did you get a new camera? No. Because that that video in the um, I don't know where you were, some restaurant or something. Um, the food show. That look because there was no uh, there was stable. Did you get like a gimbal or something? No, because when you moved, it was it was steady. The, the picture stayed stayed steady. Was um, that in the front of the beer panel? The what, with the five guests? No, I didn't see any people. It was just tables and stuff. But you were moving around, and I thought that that was very stable. I thought you had a new camera. It was a good I picture. just have a stable arm. Because I remember way back, you did a walk, a walk and talk, and you were going toward the river or the lake or something, and yeah. there was a lot of shake going on. So I yeah, so I realized that, that drove me crazy. So I decided Big not to difference. do that anymore. Yeah, well, it sh it should work. If you know, I know most of the iPhones, especially the new ones, they don't let that happen. They they have built-in stabilization. Yeah, the Samsung, I guess, doesn't have it built in, so I'd probably need a gimbal. And I was talking too. to one of my friends. He said. He bought a two hundred to three hundred dollar gimbal, and I'm not getting that. <laughs> no. Well, they're hard to operate. The the good ones are hard to operate. You got. I, I know. Um, Tropical Tim, he had a new gimbal, and he said it. Uh, I couldn't. His broke, and then he bought a new one, and he said, "But I can't get it to work right." <laughs> so he was. He did a live stream to to show how he was struggling with with the gimbal, and it was like. But I don't think it was the gimbal. I think the problem is the your your the your operator broad, your, your broadband. He's using data or something, and I think his internet was the problem. But it didn't cut out. But sometimes you don't get a perfect picture when when you go outside with with your data. I think the yeah, it's true. But I think the gimbal is just for stabilization, right? Yeah, yeah. It it just gives. Um, it's like a shock absorber. Yeah. You just you know, it's a um it's a selfie stick like oh, sort of it's it's not as long. Well, the selfie stick you can make it long or short, but it's something like that you it's going to handle and then it just keeps the phone stable. It's usually a phone. It doesn't have to be a phone, but it could be. Yeah. Um but it just Absolutely. gives a little shock absorption. It I'm, I'm not paying two I'm not paying $200 for a gimbal. <laughs> <laughs> well, if I, you, I've if, seen if, them at 100, but so you don't want to spend too little and get a crappy one that doesn't, which is useless. You so you got to gotta check out the reviews, yeah. right? Yeah. You, so. don't, you don't, you need it to be useful or what, what's the point? Um, Correct. So the, the iPhones are amazing. I can, I did a drive, a, a few drives where I was going over 80, about 82 miles per hour, which is like 120 kilo or over 120 kilometers per hour. Wow. And that's I, fast. It's, not, it's not a new pavement. And uh, when you pause the video on a on a highway sign, you can read it clearly. Wow! So um, and it's only my my, my camera phones are only 720p, but it's broad daylight, sunny day. They work well, and with a lot of lighting. I've said it before in your live streams. If if you're using 720p, make sure lighting is over there in front of you, coming at you, like this. Now, what's the difference between 720p and other p? Is that just the resolution? 1080, 1080 is yeah. Um, 1080 is a lot better. Uh, um, I, think exactly. have, I think they have a little 12 something. But that must take a lot more uh, it's memory. Just a better, just a better camera lens. It's just a better yeah, lens. Yeah, 1080p uh, takes up more storage than 720p. And uh, so it's good if people want high def, but YouTube, I don't think, really needs it. But uh, who knows? Better right? lighting, because when HD first came out, HD movies, we learned that the old movies, even the ones that were um, done in Technicolor, uh, were done uh, very well with good, good black and white cameras. And um, we were watching widescreen movies in HD from the '50s, '60s, and '70s. Really? Yeah. But not the television shows. The television shows were never done in HD. That's why the, those old sports replays are, are kind of fuzzy to look at. Oh. Um, but the movies, the good movies, the um, um, like the Good, the Bad, and the Ugly with Clint Eastwood. That was that was made in 1967. That you can see that in HD. Oh. Of, the, of the of the movie cameras, even even uh, the black and white movies. Um, 
At the end of World War II, we discovered that the, the Germans were videotaping everything. And um, everything that they were doing behind the scenes, to, they were using it for training, for future training. And um, the, what's that? It's Darren. Uh-huh. So the, um, the resolution, I watched it in HDTV. Um, the, science, the science channel got a, hold, got a hold of a lot of that. I'm back. And they did documentaries in the in the um, from the early forties. The video was was uh, HD quality. It was quality video. That's cool. so the movie makers. They um, those old black and white cameras were great, and the thirty five millimeters. Those are great cameras. Yeah. You, you can hear Norma speaking. Um, I think she's speaking of Zion in the background. Hey, Norma. Um, Guys, Norma's a great channel. She's giving instructions across. She's like. Chona is like way away from her and she's like making sure she can hear her instructions. <laughs> nice. Guys, if you want to grow your channel, Nari does, uh, I think, almost daily. We help small channels as well. She's really good. Upcoming live, please support. Hold on, down. Give me a minute. No problem. I'm going to go Tam sack that, Nari. Yeah, just put Tam sack Darren when you go to Nari's. He'll know it's from us. Tam Sack. Darren. If you want to build your channels, guys, uh, he helps flex a lot of people. There's Nari right there. 33 hours. All done, Nari. I think Jay has his, his, his uh, happy mode on. <laughs> echo, echo. Yeah. yeah. Okay, it's Nari, weird. I got you. Uh, da, 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 da. And I got how many more days? What is it? Four days to the grand live stream? Woo! 10, 11, 12, 13, five days. I think five days. <laughs> so there's that. So let's flex everybody. The time is flying. I tell you, it's getting close. That's going to be fun. Give me lots of prizes. So we're going to have a roulette. We're going to have the pick. So it's going to be good. Oh, so much work to do. Make a love shout out Nancy. Make a love shout out Ruby. A lot of the money's going to uh, charities in the Philippines. Ruby's involved with. Make a love shout out Robert. Thank you very much for coming. Robert's awesome. Very nice guy. Hey, Robert, did you do a second video? Hey, Robert. <laughs> the Daniel Show, Mega Love Shout Out, Growing Channel, Daniel Show. <laughs> now remember to type love, guys, and Nightbot will drop your link. That reminds me, I gotta put in the the uh, the live stream I'm gonna do later. So let's put these in. Da, 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 da. Darren, YouTube does funny things. The, I just got a on my phone. It, I just got a pop up. Um, they're asking me if I if I if I think the notification that you're alive is a good idea. Like, how satisfied are you with this notification? <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> they unsubscribed me to you. I wasn't subscribed to you in, um, a couple of weeks ago. And oh went, no, it no, 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 I'm not getting the the, the notifications. <laughs> It's like we did. They did it to me and my wife too. They unsubscribed me to her twice. I know. Sad. Yeah, it is. It's weird. You know what? And you know what? There are two people that I I am I'm not just subscribed to them. I'm I'm a member with that the monthly the monthly membership. Oh no! And I'm I don't see them subscribed to me. So uh, it's, so answer your question. So I'm you nine thirty doing... p.m. on Friday evening, which I think is. Same times now, but Friday. So, yeah. So in the Philippines, it'll be Saturday morning, right? Same time, same time, on, Correct. Uh, just an extra day, right? Yeah. Yeah, no difference. <coughs> it'll just be a 13 day streak for us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Singing. It'll be singing, games, and. Right. So, so I'm trying to get connected. I'm struggling here. Our oh. box, our donation for the people whose house burned down. 
Um, yeah. Uh, this is a problem with that. And, and Norma was Norma was talking about that, that she was a little bit raising her voice. Uh, yes, I guess so. I think you're five hours ahead. So 10 30, 11 30, 12 30, 1 30. Yes, correct. Okay. So, guys, here is Chef Hit Dice. And I was I was making fun because I didn't know what that meant, but I just started talking about the gambling casino or something. <laughs> there it is, right there, guys. Um, some yummy looking food right there. Uh, that's that's beautiful. That looks like I don't know what that is. Let me take a closer look at that. I'll run that video. How's that? Oh, Darren, my favorite. <laughs> you got uh, ribeyes there, I think. Is that? There you oh. go. He's calling it a New York steak, but yeah, okay, yeah, that's like a New York, New York strip, I guess. I lived Ooh. in Kansas City, and we called it KC Strip, because <laughs> the barbecue capital of the America, you know. This is 8,000 views on that one, down 7.9. Wow. Look at that. You got some, looks like jumbo shrimp. Is that what that is? Yep. Jumbo shrimps. They look gray. I hear they're pink. Which... Which, I mean, what? the, one, the uncooked ones, the uncooked ones if here. If the meat pink. is gray, it wouldn't eat it. <laughs> I mean, you know what? I take it back. I'm, I'm, um, it might not be. It, it's a little not pink, I guess. So, yeah, it's like a whitish color. So, well, no, it's, it's okay. It's, 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 okay. Yeah, it's, un, it's uncooked. I take it all back. <laughs> so, um, but that looks good, man. We, <laughs> we haven't had steak in like weeks. <laughs> yeah, we don't. Yeah, it's Are a little different here. here Jay? They have ribeye here, but it's a little bit different. It's not the U.S. Uh, meat, so you know that um, there are there are some um, some cattle here, um, but oh. it's not like it's not like going to Texas or Oklahoma or something like that or Arkansas. Oh. It's not the same, um, but it's okay. You know, it wasn't bad. It's just not as much. There's not as much beef here. But wow. if, you, if you drive in the province, you'll see a couple of cows or something or a steer or whatever they call it. I actually saw one the other day, a couple of days ago. I didn't get really? a picture of it. Though. Well, we were driving by and I saw it and I didn't. I wasn't one of the rare moments I wasn't doing video. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh, um, yeah, yeah. But I got a couple more. I got one ready, but it's um, it's um longer. How long is that? Let me take a quick look. It is almost almost 12 minutes so i had to get it all in there i didn't i didn't want to take anything out so oh, it's not, not bad was, everybody come see it's it's a it's a four minute premiere i didn't want to do that because i oh you guys are gonna like this premiere Woo, it'll like this 56 minutes what you guys gonna yeah, like someone? Someone did that in the BLF. They, uh, you know, the um, the rule is have have your premieres like under six minutes or so, and because uh, we're fitting them in fifteen minute time slots, and um, and then someone had a like, nineteen like minute. <laughs> someone had a nineteen minute premiere. And I'm like, when's this gonna be over? <laughs> yeah, I'm just like broken that rule. It was funny. Yeah, I mean, the whole idea of the group going to watch the premieres is to get a lot of a lot of viewers, make it fun, get it off to a good start, and then <laughs> the this, this time slots are not long enough to have big, long videos. If nobody wants to stay that long. Some do, but not everybody. Yeah, it depends. Yeah, it depends if they're entertained. Right. Yeah, so um, I wouldn't do a road trip you know, with a dash cam for 20 minutes. I wouldn't do that. Yeah, or even the most beautiful right. things to watch. So I don't know if I, I don't know if I'm gonna. I might do an instant premiere, but I don't know when I'm gonna do it. It's all ready to go. Fantastic music too. I found it on YouTube. Um, um, copyright free. Oh. If you go back, if you go back far enough and look long enough, you'll find some some cool music in YouTube. Well, the copyright um, free yeah. music was free, or the video was free. video was yours, right? Is my video in YouTube's music? Yeah. I, yeah, I cool. spent I spent like a, an hour or two one day not not long ago looking for, through their library and and they got a bunch of bunch of uh, pieces of music a bunch of files I guess but it's some of it's pretty good it it's very good it. yeah so you know when you do whatever you do you're in one mood especially if you're not singing or playing music so. I was looking for song files, and so I wasn't really in a singing mood. So I didn't know what was what I was gonna want. So I just took a bunch of stuff, uh, just listened for a couple of seconds, and said, "No, no, no. Okay, yeah, that might work." 
And then when I looked back, I, the first thing I grabbed was like, this is fantastic. Yeah. Okay. I think it worked. So if you guys, if you, thank you, 47. I'm getting up there. Thank you so much. So I dropped, uh, I think it pinned. Yeah, it is. Okay. So the Darren, if you guys can pan sock that, that'd be great. It's really cool. Now, when do you have your, you got a premiere coming up? Yeah. So I put it at 1045. Yep. Oh, so that's about it. It's about an, almost an hour away. Yeah, exactly. Just under an hour. And it's you're in for a treat. It's a short as well. 60 seconds? Somewhere around there. <laughs> Actually, a little more. Not more. So, uh... so short-ish. It's not a short. Correct. Kind of short. Yeah, I, don't, I, never, I never premiere a short. I'll premiere when it by mistake it's like one minute, one second. Or, <laughs> <laughs> or so then I was like, oh, I'll premiere <laughs> Didn't you? You did that once. I think you did that once. You did a, uh, a premiere for a short. Yeah. 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 It was like it was like forty seconds or something, like thirty-five seconds. Those could be pretty cool. Yes. It was funny. I did at the food show. I tried to do them under a minute, like get them to talk for under a minute. And the least she was too busy, so I just did a twenty-second. Boom! Six hundred views. And counting and, and growing. It's like, oh my goodness. It seems the shorter is go higher. I'll keep you yeah, um yeah, if they're under thirty seconds they, they have a better chance. But one of the key components is your title. I I suggest a three word title all all in not necessarily all caps, but each one should start with a cap. A capital yeah. letter. And get three words or two words. Not, hey not, emotion! Mega love shout out. Uh, so, Motion Guys, uh, if he's available, he's going to be coming up and singing some songs on my charity live stream on Friday night in North America. Thank you very much for coming, Emotion. Uh, drop your link, type love and connect. Kumbas, share. Hey, hey Emotion, make a love shout out, man. Awesome. He awesome is to see. Awesome singer. Awesome. Yeah. He's a he's a one man band, Darren. It's unbelievable. Yes, yes. And he does all his own music. It's amazing. Yeah, he does like the throwback music. The um, he calls it new R and B soul, but it's still style. The style is throwback to this. To me, I mean, from what I remember, it's throws back to the seventies. I think I don't. I don't know that much about music. Who does? <laughs> oh. Buddy Guy, the old guitar player. He's like in his mid eighties. Oh. He, he said, I'm still learning. If you keep studying you know, guitar theory, you'll, you'll study for the rest of your life. you got to get going. you gotta, you got to try to play something. Oh. People say, you don't need guitar theory, but everybody, if, if you can play guitar, you know a little theory. That's not true. You don't, you don't need to know. Nobody knows everything about guitar theory. That is true. It's too much. It started at 500 B.C. There's just too much of it. M music is complicated, oh. Darren. Complicated. I have Very. the um, I have here the um, the lead guitar riff. There's a lot of guitars and guns. Why inspire so many? When they go live, they have like four have lead it. guitar players. Um, well, the guitar one, guitar two, guitar three, guitar four, stuff like that. Now I have here the um, the tablature for "Sweet Child of Mine." The, Oh, but, um, that's awesome. But it needs to be played fast. It's 120 beats per minute. Ooh. So I, I did take one with it this morning, and it doesn't sound like it. I'm thinking, oh, wait a minute. Because I, I, I gotta, you got to do that over and over, and then it will start to sound like something. That's what? the other thing. It won't sound, if you just play the notes, it won't sound like anything there. Oh, if I can get that in there. That's that. awesome. So I get a couple, you know, books is fine, you, but you got to, there's nothing like practice. You got to play the guitar. You can't just read. That's true. So, um, that is, there's no room around that. <laughs> practice makes perfect. And you got to be in the right mood too. Those, um, if I'm just sitting here, you know, it's nighttime. I'm like, I gotta, I gotta do a piece. It won't work. You know, if you're tired and, and ready to go to bed, it won't work. True. True. Uh, you'll just be playing notes, and it's weird. It doesn't sound right. 
True. <laughs> True. I'm just flexing oh. out my video premiere. There's only three tam sacks. I gotta flex it. <laughs> Flex it, flex it. Mm. So we got we got Sheer Pencil here. We got Tammy Trot. Man, hey, good to see you guys. You got hey, amazing people. Lean Channel inspires so many. Um, the Daniel Show. The Daniel Show. <laughs> that uh, is the awesome Daniel Show. Tumbas Bohai Vlogs. Good to see you. Welcome to the show. Um, and emotions here, I guess, guys. <laughs> Halfwit's here. I didn't see you, Halfwit. Sorry. Uh, Neither did I. Halfwit, good day to you from New Zealand. I don't always see all the chats. Cause I'll stop the chat, and then we're talking for a while. And then before I realize it, there's 10 more minutes of chat, and I, and I got to catch up, and then I skip by it. It happens. We don't mean to do it, guys. We're just doing multi multitasking. Yep. It's You know, if anyone put a question in there and we haven't addressed it, then just, just repeat it, and we'll see it. Yes. <sighs> See, that's what Sean Williams is good for. Is like Sean's here a lot, and um, he'll tell us that somebody had a question. Who else does that? Somebody else does that too a lot. I forget who it was. Putt Putt King, I think. <laughs> Guys, questions are welcome, but you know. Um, you never know what the answer is going to be. That's why you ask questions, right? <laughs> you never know. It's fine. I, I, can only, I can only talk about what I know, Darren. <laughs> that's, not, Nicole, that's the way to Nicole do it. Nicole Rodenheisler, good to see you. Thank you so much for the thumbs up, guys. Thank you so much. Don't yes, we're getting up there. Didn't have much time to promote it because I was away at the food show all day today. <laughs> I got up at 6 ish. I left around eight ish, yeah. got there about nine ish. So is everyone like like laid back and tired right now? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, not too bad. But I'll tell you, I don't know if you guys have ever been to a food show. It is fun. Fanatic looks like he's ready to close his eyes. Yeah, yeah he's up early. I think it's early for him. It's nine it's almost ten um... I think it is it two thirty AM uh, <laughs> uh for you Shadow? It's four AM. Four AM? Three three fifty eight AM. Yeah. Coming up on coming up on four AM over there in Sweden. Not far north of Stockholm. That's super awesome. I'm always flexing this. Yeah. So, you know, it's late enough in the spring for him to get a little daylight over there in Sweden. Oh. You're not far enough north to have the completely dark day, right? <laughs> oh. No. No, I'm talking about Shadow. Shadow, what time yeah. does the uh, sun come up there? Here it comes uh, up six. Uh, I have no... Um, I believe it is around five or five thirty. Yeah, so it comes up a little earlier than here. Yeah, so they're not that far north, guys. Um, he because Sweden goes has a, a long distance from north to south, so the far the far north part has that issue. But there's not a lot of people up there. Mayan vlog, welcome. Mega love shout out, Mayan vlog. Okay. Built, built to last vlog is here, Darren. Good to see you. Hey, built to last. Make a love shout out. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah. Uh, all my YouTube groups. I'm part of so many YouTube groups. I think I'm part of 20. Lynn Whistler, yeah. I, I wasn't talking um, about the election so far, but um, Marcos is the Marcos Jr. is the is, He's not Jr., but he's the son of Ferdinand Marcos. Is, was elected president last night, or this morning, I should say. Oh, okay, so it's been, uh, yeah. the, we know what it's it is. Unbe it's unbelievable how we vote the same all the time and hope for different results. <laughs> unbelievable. <laughs> Unbe I could say that till the day I die, Darren, because it's true. <laughs> it was true before Christ, and it's still true. <laughs> so true. <laughs> because people... People are attached 
to their social media and that's where they're getting it they think that one thing sucks to hell and the other thing is their friend and and then they they vote for it and then they wonder i didn't vote for that what's going on here <laughs> and then they grow old and die and then their children make the same mistake exactly write that down fanatic when you're so, my age you'll say j mike was right <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to take credit for it. I'm just figuring it out along with some, some wiser people. People that are smarter than me have said the same thing. Oh. <sighs> like the, uh, uh -huh. the um, National Institute of History, I think, the NIH. No, that's the National Institute of Health. I don't, we don't like those people. <laughs> that, they're, all, they're liars. They know a little bit about health, but they're also liars. Oh, so, no. Uh, Yep. Not everybody's a liar, Darren, but the people at the top are. They have to. Or else somebody oh, no. else will be in charge. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, people call me a liar, and I'm like, all right, give me a total recall of the lie. Huh. Remind me of what I said. <laughs> Charlene Hill, Megalove Shoutout. Good to see you. Good friend of hers. Hey, Lean, Megalove Shoutout. Charlene Hill, Megalove Shoutout. Yeah. Len Whistler is a good friend. Len Whistler, I just wanted to make a, a statement about Len Whistler. Len, you get some good video on your channel. Excuse me, I just think you just need to keep doing it. Just uh, more, more, more of it, more off, a little bit more often. But you're doing good. It's it's good stuff. Um, I don't know what else to tell you. <laughs> you're on the right. You're on the right path. You're at the right track. That's good. In my opinion, <laughs> that, now that's just opinion. I don't, it, you know, I can't. Great track. That, that can't good. be a. That can't be a fact. <laughs> Great track. Uh, good, good, good. Share a pencil. That is a loud burp. I didn't burp. <laughs> I missed it. <laughs> <laughs> Our local burper. That's like a. That's like a mainstay on, on, on this channel. <laughs> Fanatic, you have a signature burp now. Um, I, don't, I don't know if it's good or bad. Uh, when did I burp? I don't Long know. time ago. <laughs> He's just uh, catching up. How far back am I chat? Am I? <laughs> <laughs> I'm caught up. I don't know. Um, I'm just reading what someone said. That's all I'm doing. One video a week is key. One video a week. Okay. Well, whatever you want to do, you're you're in charge of your channel. Um, yeah, that's fine. We're live so often, Darren. The live stream becomes a video if you don't hide it. Huh? And, um, right, Darren? The live stream, when it's over, it becomes a video. Yes, correct. So I don't, I don't consciously think, okay, I don't have any, any uh, regular videos or, or shorts, but I'm, I'm creating something every day. But when I'm on your channel, Darren, that doesn't go into my channel. So unless I do the community post, like share, like and share, guys. Let's, I'll do that right now, Darren. Like and share. Here you go. We'll share at Darren Dobson. Yay! At Darren Dobson, and then we'll we'll share it to your travel channel too. Oh, that doesn't come up so quickly. There it is. There it is. 1.3k. Awesome stuff. All right, like and share, guys, and, and we'll we'll have some fun at 100 thumbs up. We're at 55. Not bad. We'll Don't save there. it, guys, because if 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 you're trying to be number 100, once we hit like 98, it's gonna go right up to like 111. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what, that means like 10 or 12 people are doing that, or or they're not here yet. I don't, one or the other. I don't know. I don't really know, guys. <laughs> but it's it's pretty but, funny. It's pretty funny when it happens. <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah. It's like, how did that happen? We've been waiting for the last hour and a half, and all of a sudden, it goes way over a hundred. Yes, that's well, not a that's not a bad thing. It's just drama. <laughs> uh, wow, homo. Well, okay. Homo. Yeah, Timmy Trot is telling us there. stories, guys. Um, Linda Lou! The scariest holiday I had going to different places while I am traveling. Wait a minute. What did I miss? 
The chat's moving. Oh, I lost it. Um, where'd it go? She and said... Scott, um, when I was in... Palma. Pa Palma, Malacca. Ma we, oh, that's what he said. We had four bombs go off. When was that? That's scary. Oh. Four bombs go off. Scary, scary. I was here on New Year's Eve. Manila on New Year's Eve sounds like um, sounds like war, like you're being invaded by another country. It, you know, <laughs> so you could Norma could have said, "Jay, have you heard the news? China's invading and there's bombs everywhere." And I would have went, "No!" Ah! I would have known the difference because hey, two beers, mega love shout out. Uh, <laughs> it's just there's these bombs everywhere. It's like, oh my lord, firecrackers. I don't think they're bombs. They're firecrackers. Yeah, but they're not those little hand, finger sized ones, though. <laughs> Sounds like gunshots. And then I've read reports that there, people do fire off their guns. There you go. In the air, hopefully. But I, those bullets do come down, by the way. <laughs> some people get shot on New Year's Eve here. Like uh, during Mardi Gras, some, sometimes someone gets shot during the parade and nobody can catch anybody. <laughs> Because there's so much noise, you don't nobody like you can be right up point blank to somebody, shoot them, uh, and then just dance off, uh, you know, like like you're enjoying the parade. Nobody knows what's going on. Uh, that can happen. That has happened. Um, you saw it once in the in a James Bond movie, right? Uh, yeah. Live and Let Die. They showed that the Mardi Gras. They're like right at the beginning of the movie, someone got shot point blank. They, never, they didn't catch him. Oh, uh, crazy. So no. they had a mock funeral, but everyone was dancing. And the guy goes, whose funeral is it? And they went, yours. Oh, no. And as soon as he got shot, he went in the coffin, and they shot it real quick. It was like... <laughs> and then they just kept dancing. <laughs> was he dead or was he dying? Well, he was unable to cry for help. I mean, he was, he was like, dying quickly. Um, when they say he died instantly... You're you're not dead yet. You're you're not you're not legally declared dead yet. That would um, be that would be horrible. They shoot you, so you're but they shoot you're dying in the center. They put right you in the coffin, and that's claustrophobic, and they're burying you alive. Like oh no, they're not worried about that. They're worried about how how are they gonna like come to their senses. <laughs> you go into you go into shock, like you don't you can't think. You yeah, you don't really know what's going on, like a fish out of water. Green, why any? <laughs> well said. Got a coffee, a cigarette roll. Shadow, Shadow, this is your turn to talk. You're chatting in you're you're typing in the chat. Just talk about it. <laughs> hey, uh, Elanita, I'm checking to see if you have. Yes, Elanita has a good channel, guys. She's a new here. Elanita, I'm going to give you a jacket. And I'm going to watch one of your videos. Uh, let's pick uh, this, this video. Make a little shout out, Linda Lou. Thanks for there coming. Go. Back. Good to see you. Two beers is here, Darren. Yes, he is. So I'm watching a three minute, 11 second video. And a good comment on that. So welcome, Elenita. Everybody, if you're not subscribed to Elenita, please welcome her and give it a thumbs up. Angels are ways here. <clears throat> yeah, so it's a crazy week. This week I have the food show and a, a contract. And next week I get, I don't know, sometime I get trained through elections, working the advance polls. We're having elections here in Ontario. Yes, of course. That's what we would love you. Now, write, remember, write the word premier, then drop the link. People are more encouraged to go tam sack when they know it's a premier. Some people drop links of 20 minute videos. No one wants to watch it. Hey, let me too. There you are right there. Yeah, you're last. I'm still, I'm still watching the video. Elanita hey, is here, guys. Please Welcome, connect Elenita. With, please connect with her. We're at three subscribers, guys. Yep, 331 now. Uh, she's trying to grow. We like to help small YouTubers. So let's Thank look at this you, one. Linda Lou. Her dog is getting a haircut. 
Oh, that's cute. Yeah. Hey, Influence Da! Mega Love shout out! <laughs> Thank you, J. Mike. So somehow these dogs are accustomed to getting their hair cut because he's standing still. Yeah, they get used to it. It's fun. It's fun. Feels good. <laughs> they know that they're going to feel good with, with, when their hair is short. My kitchen but, TV, especially if it's in the summer, they'll feel cool. Yeah, like especially that. if it's warm out, they, yeah, they, they know. And the group, pet groomers, they know how to make the pet comfortable, too. So. Yeah, they can they can feel... My host, back in 2019, had the had a, they, they do house calls. The pet groomers, they come to the house in the Philippines. And, nope. and what they do is her dog got a haircut, a shampoo after the haircut, and got his, oh. and the, the, the old ten cl claws got clipped yeah. a little bit, little, little, just like we get our fingernails cut, and then um, they brush the dog's teeth. Oh, that's cool. And then they got a blow dry from, you know, the hair dryer. <laughs> I couldn't believe that's it. That's awesome. It's like, you're spoiling your dog. You know the how much it was? spa for? treatment. It was 300 pesos. That's like six U.S. dollars. Wow. For a house, for a house call, for a pet groomer. You, you get a send your dog to boarding school for that like overnight and uh, uh, or all day long or whatever it is you gotta put it in a cage get it in the car bring it there and it's big bucks wow. <laughs> they'll, charge you, they'll charge you like a, a week's groceries for that to do that oh oh jay Ameri and america is a rip off everybody i'm gonna keep saying that now. not only that in toronto we hit check this out i think it's for every liter in gallons 4.5 i think so it hit Ten dollars a gallon in Toronto. No, Canadian. Uh, yeah, no. Here yeah. it's here it's here it's about approximately eight dollars. Um, U.S. Somewhere around you know approximately. Yeah. Um, eight dollars U.S. And in the gallon. U.S. it's like five or six. It's it's it's. Ooh. Um, that's your current administration. It's all their policies, guys. It's like, oh. One policy of none of these policies needed had any need to be put in place, but they did it anyway because they have they yeah. have weird dreams of of everyone changing their sex and what does that have to do with the price of gas? I don't know. <laughs> people people protesting possibly not having the right to abortion, which they never should have had in the first place. They're all the gay people that will never never have a baby. I don't get it. Elanita, yeah, well, even, if, even if Rose overturned. They don't make any they, sense. The people who, yep. Well, even if Roe is overturned, the the decision making will just go back to the states. There's not going to be it, a federal level abortion ban. That decision making is just going to be at the state level. It's not like I said. It's not going to be. There's no, not going to be a federal level abortion ban. Well, if everything's federal, there's no there's no United States. Exactly. That's the problem. So, um, power to the states. Um, that's why we call it the USA. United um, States of America. Well, some states are dominated by one inner city, which is full of people that, that would never never figure things out. Um, and then they, they, they go rogue. This, I'm looking forward to your premiere. Uh, punch. I'm really looking for the premiere, How to Build True Wealth. That's actually my background. <laughs> so. It is? And how'd you get in stupid journalism? Nah, I invest into a media <laughs> I'm company. I'm just kidding. <laughs> and it's a hobby. <laughs> Which one is the Today hobby? I had a Which one is Today the hobby, Darren? Great. I was, during my live stream, I also did a 40-minute uh, on my travel channel, live. Landing for success. Channel. So I met people from Labatt's, Coors, uh, Mill Street Brewery, got all their contact emails. So, so what is, are they a think tank? I'm talking about landing for success. Is Are they a think tank? What, what is that? Landing for success, it's a networking, global network group of different people, business people from beginners all the way to super successful. They're just way people connect. So I'm going to be interviewing... One of the top two SEO people in the world, uh, ranked by Google, interviewing pe someone who uh, uh, was security for uh, two presidents, Secret Service, like really cool people I'm going to meet. That's what the movie The Bodyguard was about. Sorry? 
the movie with Whitney Houston, uh, The Bodyguard from 1992. Uh, okay. the, the Bodyguard was, was formerly working for a couple of presidents. That's how good he was. And then well, she obviously had some money, and she said, I need someone better than my, my manager. And then the first thing that happened was her former bodyguard, which was her manager, he tried to get in a fight with, with the new bodyguard, and he got his butt kicked. And he was a tough <laughs> son of a gun, too. He was like a hard ass, like New Yorker, you know. Ain't nobody mess with me. And then, boom, the well, bodyguard. Well, you take care of secret. See, if you're a secret service, you think, you're calm, you have multiple talents. <laughs> and they're always aware. Their eyes are always they're looking for facial yeah, expressions. The, Danny Aiello, Danny Aiello played the form, the former manager, you know, and, and and he thought he was tough, and he always talked tough like in the typical New Yorker, and Kevin Costner was the new bodyguard, <laughs> and then so he let Danny Aiello give him a piece of his mind, it's like you are not coming in here and be better than me, right? And then he throws his hand at Kevin Costner. As soon as he did that, he was on the ground. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> oh, you hurt my arm. <laughs> So funny. He never said anything. He just went, mind your business. <laughs> it's not your job anymore. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you, Elenita. And welcome, by the way. Elenita, you're growing your channel. Have you heard of Blessed Life? That's a good place to go as well. That, she helps build channels. That's where I started. There's a lot. So, hey, Papa King. Papa King. Are we? You get two Papa to go King, for are you going to try and win uh, Papa King on my premiere again? Watch hours. I did play uh, over 11 hours, so I'm up to uh, video 69. <laughs> so many videos. It's awesome. I like actually what Papa wins because I can actually help him. He has so many long, long videos. You do have a lot of videos, Put Put. Um, not so sure it's easy, easy, it's easy for me to play your playlist. Let me put it that way. Yeah. <laughs> so it's good. <laughs> there was somebody, I forgot to write it down to remind myself. Somebody had like a 10 hour live stream. I think oh. it was my aunt. My aunt Ski. She won, I think she won yesterday. She had a 10, 10 hour live stream. I said, this is going to be easy. <laughs> Just start the live stream. When it's oh, okay, over, it's... <sighs> That was so funny. Well, there's I, lots. I think it was my aunt Ski. Uh, or else I forgot who it was. It's either her or Bite of Jacob, I forget. Mm, going to try again. Always going to try. Absolutely. And I uh, it's I play, last night I fell asleep, so I forgot, but in the morning, I said it on maybe two days ago, I fell asleep too early, and then I woke up and played it. And I actually, like they suggested, I play the video and leave the volume on. I think the uh, that helps. So... Ah, oh, I'm Mother of Madame Phileas. That's Brett great. Glasser. Hey, Brett Glasser. Make a love shout out. Hi, Brett. Make a love shout out. Guys, connect to Brett. He's hey, Brett. Great. Absolutely yeah. great. Brett will tell you who to go visit. and He's always doing that. Yeah, it's it a very good helpful. thing. Not a bad thing. Yeah. Yep. <clears throat> Brr. Mm. Outdoor Adventures. Hey, Ed. Make a love shout out, Ed. Ed is in the house. I'm <clears throat> Panay 14. Hi, Ann. I have 992. Yay! Good for you, Angel. Subs, all you need now is video. Just start doing video. The best time to start video was a year ago. Second best time is right now, today. That's right. Eight more Annie. I think that's... Guys, connect to Annie. Don't worry about so much about your subs. Worry about your content. That's really the most important thing. When you get to 1,000... get 1,000, though. Yeah, when you get to 1,000, you don't want to look and go, I only have 900 watch hours. <laughs> you know, don't put your videos to private. If you're trying to get to 4,000, don't mark any, any videos private. Saver Keep them all sure public. Nothing gets that to go see. Yes, I know that. Exactly. That's what yeah. I do. Pop butts. I mean, two beers. That's what I do so it never goes to sleep. Before yeah, you do yeah, that, you, until I learned how to take it off. Yeah, that. you take it off of five hours sleep or three hours sleep or whatever it is. Yeah, and it plays... So now all I hear while I'm sleeping is putt putt. Telling, nope, nope, one more try. <laughs> Survey set. <laughs> we should do that right well, now. Putt -putt all night. Survey set. And a shout out to uh, Marvel you... Cuphead. Marvel Cuphead finally had a live. He's back after a month. He had a live, so I'm going to rewatch that. Uh, How many blondes actually live in Sweden? 
survey set? <laughs> <laughs> Who did we survey? <laughs> people. <laughs> Who did we survey? Uh, yeah, students in Los Angeles. Hundred random people. <laughs> yeah, hundred students somewhere near Los Angeles. <laughs> somewhere near a pizza joint. <laughs> <laughs> How many questions near a school? How many? Duh, uh, uh. <laughs> like, what's up with that? Is same question, same answer. We went Never to a semi-popular huh? pizza joint somewhere in South Hollywood, <laughs> and we asked a hundred idiots. <laughs> <laughs> if you got this, and number one is huh? <laughs> That's unbelievable. <laughs> Don't talk to strangers. <laughs> uh, uh. <sighs> I know it's rad to people. The country, the U.S. is going down the tubes, guys, and a lot of other countries are copying what they're doing. <laughs> it's like, Unfortunately. I want, I want to go to the U.S.A. Why? Because they, they invented media? <laughs> That's funny to hear. They're the hear. worst. Uh, uh, two beers goes, the only reason why blondes have more fun is because because they're easier to find in the dark. It's science. <laughs> no, the reason is because when they're not looking at you, if they're walking away, you see the back of their head. They all look beautiful. So guys chase them, and they don't <laughs> they don't realize what kind of face they're gonna see. <laughs> you, it, could, it could be like an old wretched woman, right? And she's it could be a rocker hair, from the long blonde hair. <laughs> it, could, <laughs> it could be Mick Jagger. <laughs> Sorry, Who's guy. guy with the long, it could be Steve Stein. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> what beautiful hair she has! Oh, excuse me, sorry. <laughs> Oof. Uh, Big mistake. <laughs> yeah, Elanita, we're very relaxed here. Well, you have a good time as you edu have fun, educate people. Uh, we haven't even begun talk about anything, some. and then we do a premiere where you win watch hours, get some bananas while you're here. <coughs> so flex you and get some bananas. A little bit of everything. <laughs> So and you would watch ours today, on the premiere, yeah, and then we go to entertainment. Yeah. <laughs> now, we won't do the full four hour because I do have to get it again tomorrow for the food show. So, uh, cutting it down to three hours. So, back down. But no, I would maybe do 1 30. So, 10 30, 11 30, 12 30, 1 30. Yeah, four hours. So, the verdict is in, Darren. Even if you do a crappy song, they'll still claim the copyright because they need money. Really? So people are buying uh, the rights to songs or whatever, however it's working, and they need, they're not selling, they don't sell records anymore. So they, that's true. They, the only no, way they, they can don't. get, the only way they can get a few cents or a couple of dollars is by claiming everybody on YouTube that's doing karaoke. Yeah, it's all YouTube? It's, it's, it's preposterous, but that's what they're doing. Because it's, there's, they're claiming that it's their, <coughs> it's their right for me to sing their song and then they get paid. And I get nothing. <laughs> that's what they're doing. That's that's what. They're yeah, doing. I, I like the shared revenue model because it's fair. We well, get yeah, money. There's only a few pennies in ad revenue to begin with. Yeah, it's only one penny on average. Because most people skip the ads, and then that's only one penny. But if they watch the ad, it's two cents or something like that. And I don't know the exact math. Yeah, I'm still trying to oh. clean up past videos here. <laughs> so, Elenita Utera. Um, yeah, um, this relieves my stress too. <laughs> we just like to kid around. I do anyway. I don't know about the rest of them, but uh, some guys don't show emotion on their face. They might they might think this is hilarious, but you don't you know they're not laughing and cheering <laughs> for whatever reason. Some guys do that. I used to be like that fanatic. Just sit there and yeah, that's funny. Yeah, uh, yeah, okay, whatever. So I'm cleaning uh, up some old muting some songs that I <laughs> say that. Are copyright so there's that so that's fine so they're processing they're trying to do multiple at the same time it's sad <laughs> what do you do put put king yeah so in other words chump change but a million pennies if you get a million views and you in and you, and each 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 uh, ad view gives you a penny guess how much money you get correct anyway Math, do that math right now. If I'm saying if you get a penny for every every time, every view needs to watch an ad. So if they skip the ad, you won't get as much. But quickly, I did this before and I forgot the answer. But if you do get a million views, let's put that to a million. 
times 0.01, you'll get $10,000. Now, if you get two cents for every view, that's $20,000. Someone did say, Rick Beato said that he's got millions of subscribers. He said, if you get a million views, you'll get about $20,000. So that really? was happening. That was happening for him. For him, it's it's now. There was somebody, the first person to get a million views on on YouTube. She said that um, it wasn't exactly that much money, but she said it was a, it was it was it was a nice income for nothing, for doing very little. She did say that she's been on YouTube for like since the beginning. Really? Yeah, I forgot her name though. I, I, I had subscribed to her just to to tell myself so I can remember who it is, but. No, I've subscribed to more people than I have as subscribers. I can't find everybody, and I can't yeah. remember who she was. That's true. How are we she's doing? In she's in somewhere as one of the people I subscribe to, but it would take me hours to figure out who it is. Yeah. Um, but she had long blonde hair. She was American. <clears throat> um, she started off as a teenager, like 16 or 17 oh. or 18, somewhere around there. And she's still, she doesn't do it as much, but she still has a channel. I think that's cool. And she said, yeah, my first video with one million views, I got, I got a nice paycheck. Now, the key, uh, Fanatic, if you do those how to do this or that, um, and you, you it goes viral, it could get views forever, or at least for a long time. Not exactly. Just, not just at once. But... Um, you can, One of the things you can do is once you have a video, you can <laughs> promote it again. You join a new group, promote it, promote it, promote it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but you can't repost it. You can, no. you can promote it, but you can't repost it. Correct. That will get you Correct. a little bit of Hey, Black Knight Mustang, mega love shout out to you, my friend. No, no you, can change, it. Black you can change Mustang. it in, awesome. in, in, in title it that you re updated it or something like that. You can do that, but it has to have a slight change to it. Oh, yeah, that's true. You have to mention that, you know, we're, we're going to review this video because it needs an update or whatever. You know what I would do? Uh, I was back because shorts are new. I'd take old videos that were popular, uh, make them short, and then reload but of course it has to be in this format though they're not so i can't do that sorry that was a good thought but it didn't work <laughs> just keep thinking just keep thinking of ideas ideas are good ideas good ideas are great ideas are good good ideas are great it has to be this way it has to it's that videos that are shorter than this way but in they didn't you didn't get the short thing, even though they're now, if they're really short, you could put two or three really shorts together and still have a short. <laughs> That's true. Compil that short compilation. Wonder how that would work. Yeah. I haven't seen it. Because if you take uh, three small shorts, like they say they're fifteen seconds, put three of them together, and both those were all popular. I'm wondering how it would make the next one. Or you'd have, be to, you'd have to, if you did four, you would have to chop a second off because it's going to be under sixty seconds. Yeah, it's gonna be it's like gonna you be just, 50, just 50 minutes seconds, or something about you know how people do uh, reviews. You uh, you talk about other people's videos. So take take. Uh, I wonder if you can do it in this format. Take successful videos and just do really quick on three different or two different other shorts of other successful videos. Like the most successful YouTube videos are, and then just do one, and then talk about it, talk about it, and then do another, and then talk about it. And it's still less than a minute. Post it up and see if you can that, make that viral. That'd be yeah, kind of it, interesting. Yeah, if it doesn't take off within 24 hours, it's not going to work. It won't work. Actually, I've seen some things go after two days and then all of a sudden jump. On the shorts bucket? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I would, I would, I would like not. Yeah, that did happen to me once, but um, I didn't count on that. No, I wouldn't either. Uh, the one I think it was about twenty four to forty eight hours though when that happened. The uh, the the um not the jeepney, not the um the tricycle, but the other one, the um iPhone. When the when my little nephew said iPhone, <laughs> iPhone, that, that got four thousand views. That's my most watched video. Oh no, it's the jeep, the jeepney. No, the tricycle <laughs> is my most watched video. But he he was like he's the next most watched iPhone. But that didn't happen until like forty eight hours later. Yeah. My, my mine is the boat, the ship is number one. So I did a different video of the ship. We'll put it on my travel channel. I don't think it's taken off yet, but who knows, you, right? You can monetize them if you get enough views and there's enough time in, in the in the video. You can get some watch hours out of it. Mm -hmm. but even on a short one, I got some. I got like twelve watch hours out of my out of a seven second video. 
Really? 12 watch hours? Yeah. 11 or 12, yeah. Wow. But it had 4,000 views. Wow. It's that's got, great. Yeah, it's, got, it's got about exactly 4,000 views right around there. That's great. And that's the tricycle, but that's not monetized. So, um, no, it's not monetized? Of, because part of part of if you if you load it as a short and you use the their music bucket, uh, that disqualifies it. But oh. that's why I didn't have music in the other ones. I don't. Um, it's just you don't need music for for a really short video. Which is, you know, it's either going to get watched or it's not. Okay, so the I did this a different video of the ship and put it on my travel. It says five ninety six views so far. What do we have? Well, it's not hasn't taken off yet. Where is it? And I have over four hundred videos. I have a 12 second video just showing two big mangoes out of my tree. 1,566 views. Wow. wow. Now, let me see how many watch hours that is. 12 seconds. 1,566 views. 5.2 watch hours. Oh, no wow. Uh, two subscribers, no revenue. They say that it's 1.6K. Hmm. But it flattened out after exactly 48 hours it flattened out. Yeah, that means they stopped promoting it. It got like three views. No, it got, when it when it flattened out, it's gotten, it went from 1548 to 1564. Interesting. So my boat's got 4.2. And that was 10 days ago. When it's 4.2 and it's flattened out a little bit. There it is. It just kept going forever. It flattened out. Oh, no, mine really flattened that's out. After, that's that's after like a flat line. <laughs> but that's 36 days. So it consistently yeah. went up for over a month. Nice, yeah. nice up, and then it flattened out at 36 yeah. days. Yeah. I didn't know when it was going to stop. So it's interesting. So I wonder if just my subscribers <coughs> got, got, got a look at that and nobody else. And that I'm not sure of. Not sure. Um, oh, you, actually, because I didn't check. You can go in there and find out. Yeah. See, yes, sh f uh, Fanatic, I don't think he's coming back. <laughs> no, he, he pops out. He comes in for an hour. That was exactly one hour. <laughs> oh, that's true. That's cool. Yeah. <laughs> so. Yeah, Elenita is new. Thanks very much, uh, Black Knight Mustang. Elena, connect with Black Knight Mustang. He's a great channel. Thanks, guys. Lots of good channels. So I met uh, today. I met with a guy here. There you go at the food show. So we all um, hotel group. So I'm going to uh, do my, some. Are you talking about my channel? Two, beer. two beer, Sorry, Darren. Sure. Two beers is asking what is my site. Are you talking about my channel? Uh, let me just. I'll just type in J A Y. <laughs> oh, it's hot here, guys. It's hot. J A Y. What is your site? Oh, okay. I'm going to type in J A Y. There we go. Well, I would type in love. <laughs> yeah, I did. <laughs> Dude. So there's my channel right there, guys. Um, I will support you if you come in and, and um, leave me a quick comment on one of my videos. I'll support you guys. Hey, Toby. Toby's um, coming. Now, sometimes it takes me a couple of days to, to get over there, but um, it could be right away. Who knows? I don't know how much. It depends on how, much, how many videos I'm running. Like right now, I'm, I'm only running two right now, so that's not bad. You have a chance, guys. Now, Angels Are We, um, everybody's looking at their sub count. Yeah, but the most important thing is you watch ours. You sh so when we talk about making videos, you get your ideas from watching other people's videos, and then they'll help support you if you leave them comments on their videos. They'll start to, they'll want to support you, at least help. And that's key. And, um, but the real key is to make video content because some of us are a thousand subs and then we want more because it gets addictive then we want more then we have 1100 then we have 1200 and then we have 1300 it, it's addictive and then we don't have any anybody watching our videos and then we don't have the watch hours and then we're looking for more subs it doesn't work that way so some people well, I always say the subs. i always say go for bananas then worry about watch hours then once you got watch hours are monetized and worry about keep improving well, on your videos. Keep going. If you if you do no promotion, like if you don't fish for subs 
and you may have a great channel, great content, and good videos, a lot of them, you'll get subs. People will subscribe to you. Like you, a, you actually, you know. if you have a good video, because I'm, I'm, I've got to rewatch some other videos, how these guys make successful videos. If you do good video content, meaning people watch over 50% your whole video, the analytics look at that and then they promote your channel. The algorithm, yeah, yeah, they're looking for that. Um, a larger percentage of your videos. That's why long videos don't do that. Because if you, because um, if you, because YouTube is there to make money. So if, if people are watching your videos, those are the ones they want to put ads in. <laughs> people are watching. Guys, you, we, just remember to leave a leave a quick comment on one of the videos, and then I can I can help you. I will come support you. There's Australia Lander info. Mega love shout out, my friend. Bung Romy. Australia yeah, info. Good morning, Jack. Yeah. Mega love shout out. Two beers, Darren Dobbs. What have you skipped through part? Get to the end. I think a good question. Uh, I don't think that you'll get the watch hours because you're shortening. And it, well, I think it's the AI is pretty smart. You skip through half of it, then it says you watched half of it. Basically. So, what is the microblogging <coughs> feature, Darren? A AUS Australian Lander Info. I think it's Aussie, right? AUS. Yeah, Australia. Um, it's talking about the uh, microblogging feature. Can tie Don't know what all it is, my yeah. online stuff together from podcast to YouTube to blogging. Yeah, I'm not sure about that. Um, you do I. If it makes sense to you, if it makes sense to you, then go ahead and do it. But I'm not, I'm not sure what, what exactly how that works. <laughs> uh, um, Conscious yeah. business services and opportunities. Welcome and good morning. <laughs> yes, we will be singing after the premiere. We're just so, making. Yeah, and Two Beers has a question. What it if you on YouTube. Skip, okay. through the, skip through parts to get to the end? You won't get watch time for that. Um, if you look at your analytics to see how many people are watching your video through the length of the video, you'll see peaks and valleys. And if you see an, a spike, it's likely that someone skipped ahead or they watched it and went back at a certain point, and then that will get more. That little two-second segment will get a spike. So there. Um, Make a love shout out, Trisha. The algorithms are counting the actual watch time you're running the video, the actually running it on your on your computer. So if you skip that, you won't. That doesn't count as watch time. That's right. Make a love shout out to Trisha. <coughs> I'll uh, get your proper channel, Trisha. Is that our Trisha? That is our Trisha. So I'll get our proper channel. Jeez, Conscious that's business like services, make a left shout out. Guess it's a ninja. Trisha De J. Ligawan. Yes. Oh, I said that wrong. So my eyes are blurry right now. I don't know why. Trisha J. Liwagan. Guys, yeah, there's Trisha's uh, main channel. Feel free to connect with her. She's like a young and up and coming superstar. She can sing, guys. She's, Singer, she's got, oh, live she's streamer. Got, yeah, she's young and she can sing. And she's smart. Darren, read what I said about watch hours. Yes, I heard that. Uh, guys, uh, Black Knight Mustang says you can put it time to do and do it extra fast. Uh, and you'll get the watch hours. So now, I know you can do that. I know you get watch hours. But uh, there's still debate about it. But I think, I think you'll still get watch hours. Because you are watching just faster. But Don't forget the the algorithm knows because you're using you're using YouTube's tool, the viewer, when you do that. And it's you know it's the Google browser, but it's it's you're doing it in YouTube. Thank um, you, Tammy. They know when you're speeding up times too, so they might divide it by two. I don't know. Well, we'll have to look into that. Yeah. Um, I but I, I that's what I, I heard as well. That. So I started I watching times too, and then yeah, I, heard I wouldn't try that. I do a regular guys. speed now. Um, yeah, I wouldn't try it. Um, they have they have ways of because it, you, it, you, you're probably using the Google browser with the um, and the the YouTube player, the, whether it's the mini player that we're watching, 
that's owned by Google. So, okay, good. Uh, so he's tried it. Black Knight West has tried it. Perfect, Black Knight. Thank you very what's much. What's he saying? What's he saying? He says it's true. Many people I ran watch hours for yeah. and with no problem. Uh, that's uh, I think the jury's still out on that. I I, I I'm not comfortable with that. Um, and make a love shout out to Sammy. How are you doing, Sammy? Because you can't you can't, super smart, an, guys. you can't analyze your view count for 48 hours anyway because they're they're um they're verifying it and they they've said that that they're verif they take 48 hours delay on your watch hours because they're running tests to verify it. So uh, something tells me that that's going to come back to not work for everybody. Because um, when you get a subscribers, they take it away and then they verify it and then they give it back to you or not. <laughs> so and usually you don't get them all. Yeah, they make um, adjustments. They make adjustments after the fact. Because we're we're connecting friends here and a lot of people are making uh, are, are are in a hurry to to make those connections and then YouTube determines that that's not a real connection. Yeah, and it, that's just what they're doing. Hey, Adrian! Adrian, we, miss, is we, in the miss, house. we yeah. miss you, sir. What's going on? What have you been doing? Just been busy, you know, around here at home, and you know, wrapped up Mother's Day weekend finally. Nice. Wrapped up Mother's Day weekend. What does that mean? Well, I spent the Mother's Day weekend here at home with my mom, and you know, took her out and stuff like that. You know, just you know. Getting ready for other things coming up, so. Hi, Tammy. Hello, everybody in chat there. So, so what, you, what you got coming up, Adrian? What you got coming up? Have you picked a new channel name yet? <laughs> um, Darren, actually, that's why I'm here tonight, because I'm just going to stick to my name only for now. Everybody knows me with that, so I'm just going to stick with that. Yeah. I'm I'm uh I'm I'm uh, starting a third channel on my anniversary. Name no, well. you're not. No, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> I think you have two is more than enough. <laughs> Everybody mute. <laughs> Everybody <laughs> mute. That's, that's I'm, not gonna have I'm not going to have time to watch any more Shadow Scout Swedes videos. <laughs> Shadow, this this is going to screw you. <laughs> Probably <laughs> not. Well, then also, uh, this coming week is going to be a little bit of a busy week. It's already started, so. What are you doing this week, uh, this coming week, Adrian? Well, I've got uh, my niece. She's, she's got uh, her first Holy Communion ceremony this Friday, so. Yay! That sounds like a video. Yeah, it's going to be a video I'm going to be recording, so that way. When I, I get back so. on my channel, it'll be there. So, <laughs> no, I haven't got my head. Now, how can we follow you? Can Can you type in love and ha let us follow you right now? Well, I haven't started my channel yet, uh, Jay, but pretty soon I am. But, and then, guys, um, this coming Thursday, this coming Thursday is uh, is a very special day for me. So, yay. What is Thursday? What what's the occasion? My birthday's coming up, Jay. This coming Thursday is my thirty sixth birthday, so I'm gonna. Yay! So May twelfth. I'm 12? gonna be celebrating my birthday. Wait, so May twelfth. You're still a kid. Yeah. <laughs> May twelfth. That's awesome. One day before my anniversary. S Media Mega Love shout out. Uh... Okay, guys. I think the premiere is going to be starting in one minute. So up All here, right. guys, the Darren premiere. It's right in the blue area. It's the last Wait one. Long ball. Wait long Hello, ball. Outdoor Adventures 902 TV. Hey, Hello, Ted. Hey, Ed. Hey, Ed. I'll copy that. Share it. Copy. Go back. I'll flex it just to make it That's easy. That's the third one right there in the third um, link in there. Yes. One, two, oh, the last one. Hey, guys, live premiere. Uh, last two comments win uh, 10 Thank watches. you, Tammy. Thank you. And Binai Vlog 14. Thank you. Last two comments win 10. I'll put it here. Two win 10. And hello, Sammy. Sure. Sammy Chavez, hello. Good luck. 
Okay, guys. Lee, hello, welcome to Darren's Live, and we got two beers in the house. Let's two beers. Hello, Adrian. How are you, my friend? Nice to see you again. I am very. Where's the premiere link, guys? Okay, I'm gonna head over to my premiere. <laughs> Hope to see you guys there. It's up short, so don't worry. What? What? <laughs> my premieres yeah. are short. What? What? There he goes. A short <laughs> countdown too. There you go. <laughs> This is a How are really you doing, my friend? Great. Seattle, how are you? Well, I'm doing good so far. How are you doing, two beers? I'm doing well, Darren. I'm doing well, Adrian. Thanks for asking. You can you can As both. You may or may have not heard, I'm going to the Philippines on uh, Monday. This more coming Monday. Yes. Oh wow. Oh, okay. The uh the advanced polls don't come till after that. What? Uh, Vance polls for that. Hello, Luz. The election was today. No, that's in the Philippines. I'm talking about in Ontario. Oh, I don't give a fuck about them. <laughs> <laughs> I know Ford's going to get back in. So, Darren, how's everything coming along with you on going to the Philippines yourself there? What's going to happen with that? Uh, well, as long as they allow us, they don't change anything and lock it down. I'm going, leaving on the 6th. Going to flying to Europe, then oh, staying ten hours and continue on land on the eighth. Okay, oh, cool. Bad. Sorry. So we'll. See. And a special hello to to uh, <laughs> the one who just called me the golden voice, S Media. Hello to you. <laughs> I have a question for Jay. Jay is living in the Philippines, is he not? Yes, yeah. he is. Okay. Yes, he is living with his wife now, so they are officially together now. Now, my question to you, Jay, is what would you recommend for a SIM card uh, for me? I'm going to be there for six to eight weeks this time around. I think he's on mute. He may went he's on mute car. right now. He has his camera off, too, so may he'll be back in just a moment. <laughs> It's probably in the kitchen or in the bathroom or doing something. <laughs> probably busy uh, or making, is probably talking to his wife right now, probably. I was going to say making nice, nice to his wife. <laughs> hey, guys, the uh, premiere is go open. Go, 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 go. <laughs> it's linked about. Woohoo! <laughs> and what is that a premiere of, Darren? That is the uh, uh, prototype car of the Rimac, new Rimac car. Oh, I wanted I wanted to see the prototype boat called Nuvera. You hear about Rimac that one? Nuvera vehicle assembly. You hear about that? That uh, what do they call it? An E2 class racing boat, battery powered. Yeah. Very first one from Mercedes. What? From Mercedes? No. This is a, a racing boat. That's from the same guy who apparently pioneered the uh, usage of the pro the usage of the battery power. Yeah. The way that the power gets fed, apparently up to uh, a certain point, not too long ago, that was a, a big problem. Oh. There he is. He's back. And anyways, and he's also he's also the leader. Ladies in the, and gentlemen, uh, Jay Mike Grand, has returned. Grand Prix racing cars. Yeah. <laughs> so now he's getting it. Now he's getting into boats. That's cool. Hello to Ruby also. <laughs> but yes. apparently, you can buy yourself an electric motor from I think it's GM. Hey, Darren, is there a final chatter here? There is. Two <clears throat> How many? So, two? Two. That would be neat to see somebody adapt that motor onto a, a boat. 450 horsepower. Wow. I That's wonder great. which would hit the finish line first, the boat or yes, the Yes, last two comments. In the in last two comments in the chat of the video. <laughs> it's, it's Well, Jay, did you see that one there with the uh, five 900 horsepower Verado motors on the back? It's good to how see you was, too, how Tammy. How big was the boat? How, how, what size boat was it? I think it was like 58 feet. Oh, yeah. How, how, does, how does it do? No, Five I, I 900, just... 900 horsepower motors. 
Five? Five. Wow. Outboards. And and it's and the the outboard stays steady. It's the prop in the bottom Hello, that, Robert. that spins around. Three hundred and sixty degrees. Wow. 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 Yeah, I, get, I would have to see that. I can't imagine it. <laughs> so, Conscious Business, good to see you. Thanks for stopping by. We'll see you later. Yes. Oh, and uh, Jay, uh, a special happy Mother's Day to your wife and all everybody there in the Philippines, of course. That's Thank awesome. you. Yeah. Yeah, they're, they're watching. <laughs> they're listening to the show back there. They, sh I, they should hear that in about four seconds. Okay. okay. Well, I, I was. At, I had a question for you, Jay. I'm going to be there for six to eight weeks. What yeah. SIM card would you recommend? I I don't. I just have the Apple phone, and I don't have a Philippine number. I just we just use Norma's phone for for local business, and we use my phone for my whatever I need to do with banking and stuff like that. Um, yeah. So I don't. I don't know. Um, I don't have an answer for that. <laughs> it's got to be one Thanks of the for that two greedy, majors, Tammy. Though. Never gets old. <laughs> yeah, but, but the, two majors. I get. I guess I gotta get in the airport. I guess. That's yeah, where you can get him at the. Yeah, you can get him at the airport. But I have yeah, no you idea. You can get him airport, street vendors, convenience stores, the sorry, sorry stores. Yeah. <laughs> Practically uh, they, anywhere. They say the smart card, but they have smart and globe. I, I don't know. Um, this, they say that when I did my uh, load, I, I used uh, smart. Well, apparently there's a new new player now. And this is by presidential decree. I think it was about a year ago, called Ditto, D I T O. Yeah, Ditto. And by pre presidential pre presidential decree, Globe and Smart amalgamated their services to improve the Wi-Fi coverage in the Philippines. Ooh, you mean aug augmented. Yeah, I mean, right here we get good we get good Wi-Fi here. It's like the mid the mid price Wi-Fi here. It's pretty good. We, we live stream. I I can run like twenty tabs at the same time. It's, we're not having issues here. Yeah, that's but not we, worth we it. We upgraded our router. Uh, it's we get a Huawei, uh, a Huawei. I think it's how you say it. Router, Huawei. The, the Huawei. Yeah. Uh, the Chinese one, but it's it's working for us. We're not we're not talking about secrets here. So I'm not worried about. <laughs> Spied. You know, Apple spying on you too, guys. It's not. Yeah, but it, it's not worth it for me to get uh, a wired internet service for six weeks. Oh, no. hello, true. Kappa. Yeah, How just, you doing? Just, just get the load. Um, um, two beers. Just get the load. But I'd like to get be able to get the data to slave slave my wife's phone and my uh, and do some uploads through my phone. Now she's with you. You're going to travel together, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, um, yeah, I'm. So I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get the ballot by hand stamp when we get there. I would just get some load and just review and, that when you need it. I guess I don't know. And because I'm coming in as a ballot by hand, I don't have to pay for insurance. Oh, oh. Uh, is that a new rule? Because when I came in, there was no rule that said I had to have insurance. <laughs> And that was well, about, apparently, apparently, like tourists are supposed to have insurance coverage to cover something like uh, up to seventy-five thousand dollars if they fall ill or something like that. That was not yeah. mandated when I got here. They didn't even ask me that question. They asked me if I had the um, the RT-PCR test before I flew. Yeah. And I said, I said no. They said, okay, you're gonna have seven days of quarantine. Well, old, old dog five. just had a old dog just message had a, in the in the in the in the chat for you there, Darren. <laughs> Darren, that must be good to the last drop, right? It sure is. <laughs> Old dog in the, the Philippines. You've seen his blogs? Who? Old dog in the Old Philippines. Old dog, I've heard of him, but I don't follow him. He's got about 45,000, 50,000 viewers now, I think. Yes, but in, anyways, he just he had, he had went to the States because he thought, thought his old man was on his deathbed. Yep. And he had to take care of banking stuff and all that stuff back in the States. Then came yeah. back. Take care, BKM. He Good got to the, see you. He got nice the insurance you, and a few other travelers that, that were with him in the plane also came in the same way. They all had insurance 
they were never asked anything about the insurance when they went through customs. Right. Yeah, that was my choice. I um, I thought about it, but then at the last minute, I didn't get it. Um, you know, it's not mandated, but so that's the current rules <laughs> now. Yeah, we're we're all in this panic, and so if it wasn't mandated um, five months ago, six months ago, I don't know why it's mandated now. And, and the one health it doesn't pass, make sense. The one health pass. Got to get that before you board the plane. Not necessarily. Well, I'm going to get it just in case. <laughs> let yeah. me let me let me finish. Just to be on the safe it's, side, it's, right it's, there. It's, <laughs> it's free. Yeah. So I let got me, it, but... let me finish. Let me finish. But. You have to have the RT-PCR test on arrival if you didn't have it before you left, and they list like six different places. In the I wish they did that done. to me because I had to wait seven days, and then they gave it to me. And then, like, if I did it right away, that would have been better. Yeah. So that's not a. That's probably the only good thing that's happened since since December or November. And the, um, on the question on the questionnaire and the one health pass, they ask you when you had your first shot and when you had your second shot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've I've, yeah. I've had I've had four. I've had three. And my wife has had three. I only had I've one. only had three, so I've only had one, and I don't anticipate getting any more. Doing good, Robert. And I got the flu shot too. <laughs> so, really, new I member COVID, Darren Linda was, was the new flu. Hey, who's yelling? We're talking. Adults are talking now. <laughs> Just, I'm just messing with you, Adrian. It's good to see you. <laughs> yeah, you know, I got, I got, I got one of those things too, but I can't be bothered to hook it up. Here, the sound card, yeah. I don't use it too much, just enough to be funny. But no, I don't have it, a, the pe no, I don't have I, a sound card. If I use it too much, then it starts to suck. It's, it's, it's too much. You know, I gotta keep that to a minimum. Hi, my favorite YouTuber. Oh. <laughs> don't take it the wrong way, everybody. <laughs> My wife's a TikToker, and uh, I'm like, when is it going to stop? <laughs> no, it's all the time. It's like. <laughs> I, Jay, you know, I have that app too, TikTok. I have some videos on there, but I haven't really done one anymore. I just got the, so tired of just wasting time trying to figure out what to do next on there. You so. either have to be a girl right, who can dance, or you have to really be clever with practical jokes. Yeah. Yeah. Um, True. What's what's the point of being on TikTok just to make faces? I don't get it. <laughs> I don't get it. Well, but, you know, like it. it's good enough. It's good enough. So, well, see, the girls are okay, but all these silly sound effects is like, I can't stand. It's like hearing a dog bark twenty four hours in a row. And that could be really annoying, honestly. <laughs> you mean it sounds? You mean it sounds like rap music? No, the those the, uh, the, no, the, the sound, sound effects effect noises like, that they use. Yeah, like the, it just doesn't stop. It's like really. Yeah, that's what I mean. It's, it's like not rap, funny. It's like, the, it's like rap music. If you have, yeah, but if you have to inject a funny sound to make people realize that you're trying to be funny, life clean. Then it ain't funny. Yeah. yeah. If they get a million views, I would do it too. <laughs> Well, they're getting a thousand views. They're not getting a million views. Okay. I've only got controlled. one video on TikTok that's got over a thousand something views yeah, already. But the, that's just that's just the only popular one I have right now. Guys, so. the algorithms are looking for looking for somebody not named uh, J. Mike and Darren Dobson. I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> um, they're looking for something else, guys. They're looking yeah. for twenty something and cute. <laughs> Uh, nobody's uh, debating me. <laughs> <sighs> Let's look at the chat and see what they have. To I, was say, I, say. Think, I was thinking of a guy, <coughs> but the names are just a blank to me when, right now. Yeah. He's quoting, who was the, the big talk show host, the first one? Mm. With the good silver hair? Uh, ooh, ooh, the... A current? Is, is oh. current or? No, he, he's dead now. Oh, Johnny Carson? Johnny, Johnny Carson. Carson? Not his so. his sidekick, Ed McMahon. He's dead too. Ed McMahon. He was the guy who always started the laughs. Yeah. Oh. Uh, so he was the sound. He was the sound oh. effect for the show. Right. Yeah. 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 Oh. That's true. Yeah. Wow. That's... Oh, I hear that. Oh, oh, oh. 
Yeah. Interesting. <laughs> you know, they, they, There's they the Toby to showed up. Toby. <laughs> and they would Just have passing a, through. Passing through, Toby. They would have a production assistant on the side of the stage, always out of camera view, and he would hold up a card that say, like, laugh. Oh, or, and then they, they, would, they did have this button. <laughs> no. <laughs> he had live audiences, but they would hold up a cue card to the audience. Well, that's where they made this oh, button. They, they recorded it, and then they did this. <laughs> also, they had applause as well. Applause signs, applause. Signs. Yeah, and then in the seventies, uh, in the mid seventies, they came up with the uh, with the um, the neon light in the, above the audience. You know, laugh, quiet, please, <laughs> stuff like that. <laughs> laugh, applaud, quiet. <laughs> Same with golf. I, 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 signs, I, I, I personally, I personally saw that in the seventies when I worked for a short time for a TV station. Oh yeah. Yeah, I was the duty technician. My job was to keep the station on the air. Yep. Yeah. One time, one time they talked me into operating a camera for a uh, musical show on some guy. They were trying to promote his image or something, and he did. They did tape shows for several weeks. And then one, he's trying to do this song. And we're on like Take 40. Take 40. Mm. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. And, you know, we're in the studio. It's hot as fucking hell in there with the, all the floodlights. <laughs> yep. Take 40. Yep. <laughs> I, I got my headset to the to the, uh, the producer. And I says, can I stay, step in there for a minute? Okay, thank you so much, Robert. And uh, help this guy out. You know, take 40. It's getting hot in here. I want to go home. He if goes, there was one person that I would see was a very good, also good talk show host was Jay Leno. He was one of my favorites. Yeah, I agree. Jay was one of my favorites, even though he's retired now. But, yeah. you know, he was a very good talk show host. I'd he watch him from, a, I'd watch him from the, like, I think he started, like, at, believe like at 10 30 my time of 10 30 or between 10 30 and 11 till about almost 11 12 o'clock at night jay leno went to my high school he was friends with dennis leary and and, and uh, lenny clark leno didn't have a sidekick did he no, no. he never no. did nope. he did everything by himself his, his competitor did right Oh, yeah, the only the person other. that would speak Letterman. would be one of the musicians yeah, that Letterman. would be. Letterman, had, Letterman had, and the piano player, the um, the guy yeah. with the bald head. Yeah, the oh, the band band leader. Letterman, yes. He was a good Schaefer. one, too. The Schaefer. band leader from Sudbury, Ontario. Paul Schaefer. Yeah, he's Canadian. Sudbury. Yeah, he's from Sudbury, of all places. <laughs> well, same place as Shania Twain. Yeah. That neighborhood. <laughs> hey, Darren, is uh, David Letterman Canadian or what? Not David Letterman, but uh, Paul Ooh. Schaefer was. Oh, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. So was Super Dave. Yep, that's oh, true. I've heard of Super Dave. I've heard of that one. <laughs> Gary's Canadian. Uh, Anne Murray's Canadian. Uh, My parents are Canadian. Both of them. We oh. they drove over the border and and popped me out. <laughs> all the, all the, there's seven of us. So all of us. All of us are Maine. Born in, a, in a Maine. We're all born in Maine. That, uh, what's his My name father there? left and had three more kids born in Maine. <laughs> what's his name? The, the Indian comedian? It's good to see you too, Al Adventure 9022. I'm really bad I'm with brother. names. Oh, I... I'm bad with where people are from. It doesn't matter. Excuse me, Adrian, can you take a look and uh, mute the audio on your YouTube page, which is running in the background? He's mute now. He's just muted. Sorry, my mother's got her music on. It's, it's coming. I'm sitting down here in the kitchen. It's coming from this area, so I'm going to have to mute myself for a moment. Okay. No problem. Yes, Toby's relaxing. <laughs> That's my sidekick. That's what cats do. That's what they do best. They relax. Eat, sleep, and poop. Eat, sleep, and poop. That's the cat's life. Nothing more. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> but this one, of course, wants to every so often go on live. Well, You'd be surprised. Cats are like awake at night. Mm -hmm. Oh, but they, but we're quiet, so they don't make noise because nothing's going on. Oh, oh, cool! That is so so cool. 
Yeah. So yeah. So so do I need health insurance? I'm gonna get. I already have it. I don't think Cross. it's mandated. I don't think it's mandatory. I don't think I need any extra health insurance. But if you need hospital care, it's gonna cost you. That would prove it costs a lot of money. Hospital care right now is starting to get more expensive now. Well, on the one health path, one health pass application, they don't mention anything about insurance. I don't think. No, not. Oh no, I, they do. Here, they do. They do. I've been here almost six months. It wasn't mandated. Nothing was mandated. It wasn't mandated to have a uh, a vaccine. It wasn't mandated to have an uh, RT PCR test. Yeah, but uh, you came in as a ballot guy. I no, I came in as a uh, 9A uh, spousal. Uh, she oh, petitioned. Okay. She had to petition me, then had to get certified, uh, notarized. Yeah. And, um, but same rule. But not having the RT PCR, the vaccine did nothing. The RT PCR test uh, <coughs> moved my quarantine from five days to seven yeah. because I didn't have it. So it's just a totally oh, okay. difference on the quarantine. So the quarantine was very boring. I didn't have a view of anything. And I had no human contact. Well, no, Ex apparently, except for the phone. No, apparently the way I. Is it still the same, Jay? If you go to the, just, you don't have to quarantine anymore, do you? If you go over there to the Philippines. No, but you're gonna have you gonna have the, the pre-flight test, and you're gonna have the the vaccine card. Yeah. If you don't have the pre-flight test, you can take it, have it taken on what arrival. What they really want I think they'll probably take you in the back of a fucking police car to the place to get tested. What they really want to know is, um, do you have any comorbidities? They don't ask that question. They ask you if you have this, that, and the other thing, and those are the comorbidities. That's really the issue. There's a question in the chat for you, Darren, from Tammy. Ah, oh, Darren, me and Papa King are wondering if shut out the answers in your sleep. Ah, uh, no, I don't. I don't share the answers. <laughs> At least I don't know. I haven't, I've never filmed myself doing a sleep live stream. <laughs> You're talking about answers to the family feud questions? Yeah, because I'm playing in the background. <laughs> so, <laughs> survey said. Survey said. What, what country has the most women with blonde hair? Survey said. <laughs> California. <laughs> I said, name a place where, where there's there's lots of people on a beach. You said, survey said, Florida. I'm number one answer, Florida. <laughs> I watch Family Feud every once in a while when I have time. The answers are, like, um, illogical sometimes. Oh, two beers. Do, so I do I have to get an antigen test? Or not a PCR? Uh, no, the antigen test is valid for 24 hours. Right. The, R the, uh, the other one was RT-PCR. Uh, that's expensive. Uh, it's valid for, for 48 hours. Yeah. That one's expensive because the what's funny is I'm going to Amsterdam, then I do a 10-hour layover, then continue on to the Philippines. Uh, but the thing is, the PCR, they rip you off in Canada, it's 150 bucks. Well, I'm getting it for 135 of Chopper's Drug Mart. Yeah, that's where I mean. The Chopper's that's Drug a lot Mart. of money. A lot. You're welcome, Tammy. There's it was another, fifty bucks for me. There's another one that does it for seventy-five bucks. Guys, drive up to Steels and Young. The Philippines. There was a company here. I forget the name of the company, but they charged me fifty-two bucks for the RT-PCR test. Yeah. After my and quarantine. And I did a search for uh, having the test at the airport. Okay. It's on the airport grounds, but it's not in the airport. You're getting ripped right. off. It's down the street from there. And that, how much they charge there? Uh, I think it was 189 plus tax. Yeah, uh, they're ripping you off because you're yeah. in North America. Yeah, North America true. is one big rip off right now, guys. I'm, I feel sorry for all of you. Yeah, unfortunate. So. Oh, that's cool, well, Tammy. To hear. We're, 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 Darren and I are lucky. We're Canadians. We got old hip. Yeah, you're paying for it in in, in the long run. In our taxes, taxes. We're paying for it in our taxes. Yeah, yeah. you're paying for it. But well, back then, they also would make uh, to where you, when you filed your uh, income tax paperwork, you'd have to show health insurance too. If not, they wouldn't uh, allow you to do anything like that. But they don't they don't mandate that anymore either. So, but they used to. Who's not mandating that? Well, the other president before, you know, like. With Biden now, he's done it to where nobody has to have uh, 
insurance to show whenever you do your income tax now. So that was created under Barack Obama. Yeah, Barack Obama, but Biden still follows that. But with Trump, you know, there was, it was different. But I don't want to get into the whole political change, that thing. That didn't here, change so. under Trump. You, the president can't just make an executive order to change that. It doesn't work that way. Just go. Well, things are starting to change up here, Jay, in, in the U.S. Yeah. right now. So, okay. charge, charge it. <laughs> yes. Oh, yep. Yes. Fifty percent of our tax in our province goes towards hospitals. Yep. Yeah, but uh, but you don't have to worry about having a heart attack and having no health insurance. Yeah, I know. Or worry about uh, paying deductibles getting hit, or yeah, or getting hit by a car. Or... Yeah. Tripping and breaking your leg. But still worth it. Yeah. We've used it. What I'm starting to do now, Darren, is, uh, you know, I'm looking into uh, a charity where I could donate some money now. So I'm going to start doing that pretty soon also. Check in. There's there's three. Well, there's two major ones that we're supporting in the Philippines. And that's, uh, uh, you'll see videos that uh, Renny OC has done. And there's, uh, we're, I'm going to be doing a lot with Ruby. In two different areas, Iloilo and Boracay. She has people. We're building. Uh, Damn, a how do you th- we're building a home for somebody. It's only three hundred seventy-five dollars Canadian, and we're oh. building this guy a simple home. Cinder blocks and sand. <laughs> I don't <laughs> think. I think it's wood and bamboo, but I don't think it's cinder block. Cinder well, block, I think, is probably. I think they have to do the the lower part in cinder block. It, it would be advisable no. to do. No. Darren, when you have time, feet. there. Uh, PM me the charities, will you? Mm-hmm. It's charity bloggers. How do you think it Yeah, would go well, over? just send me some videos that I can watch so that way, you know, I can uh, have a look. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Hey, guys, Freelancing Tips for Beginners by Christy Angelo is in the house. Hey, Christy. Thank you, Christy, for coming. Guys, connect with Christy. Mega love, shout out, Christy. Type love. L O B E. Christy's got a lot of energy on her live streams, Darren. She's awesome. Did, she like, did really you take a happy people? pill this morning? <laughs> she gets up with pretty people. And she goes one by one, very methodical, uh, you know, uh, flexing people's channels, premieres. She, Darren, she makes everyone feel important as soon as she sees that you, you've you come in. That's right. If she She's sees really you're right. in Okay, the, in the guys, chat, I got to get you? off of here and say goodbye. I got to go uh, get in the shower, get ready for bed because I got things to do tomorrow. So it's nice to see everybody here. Nice to see you too, Adrian Rarite. Jay, it's nice to see you coming. also. And hopefully I'll see you guys again next time. Thanks for stopping yeah, by, I'll Adrian. I'll live again in two days. <laughs> All right, well, if you're Peace live tomorrow. again, I'll stop by. I'm live Peace tomorrow. tomorrow. Take Same care, Adrian. Tomorrow. J. Mike's All live right. tomorrow. Guys. Shadow, nice to see you. Two beers is good to nice see to you see too, you my too. friend. Y'all guys, to everybody in chat, take care. I'll see everybody next time. God bless you guys, and I love everybody here. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Bye, Adrian. Thank you so much. And exclusives in the house. Mega love shout out, Ann. And mega love shout out. <laughs> so who won the, um, did Putt Putt King win the last chatter? Pat Pat King won the last chatter, which is perfect. So I'll be playing that. I'll be playing him all night long. All night long. All night, night long, night. Bobby Boucher. All night long. All night. I'm going to hear it in my head. All night long. <laughs> Pat Pat King, my cat's used to hearing you too. You can babysit my cat. My cat knows you. Well, I don't, and I thought we didn't need PCR tests. We had vaccines. Yeah, it wasn't required when I got here. So, but I had to do two extra, yes, uh, you did, you two did, extra did. days in quarantine. Yeah, rules change you all right. But it's too hard. It was, class too, it's, it was too hard to get it at the last minute. You had to have, have it within nine, 72 hours of arrival, and, and I couldn't do that. So, that <coughs> yeah, it's so it. difficult. When I had to go to. Middle East. It had to be 48 hours. I was leaving on a Monday. Things were closed on a Sunday. Saturday was difficult. So I, I was talking to the guy on the phone to bring the exact time they had to do an exemption to squeeze me in. And they said, well, it's not. You're supposed to get it within 48 hours. It's, it could be. I called the local Walgreens. Like, oh, my goodness. Darren, I called the local Walgreens because they said that they do it. 
that we have the RT-PCR test if you're traveling. And, but they said I couldn't do it for like, I had to schedule it two weeks in advance. I said, I, I need 48 hours. I can't wait two weeks. It was, it was ridiculous. So they haven't figured it out yet. Was, so was, there was, and the there government's was no... doing it. And, and well, just to make it more difficult, make it in 24 hours. Well, when, when are you flying? If you're flying in the middle of the night, you can't. Or, or you should just have it at the airport on demand. Like, you know, go in the airport and it's like, anybody need an RT-PCR test? Get it right yeah. here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But it takes longer. It takes, uh... I was very impressed when I went to the Middle East. They were so efficient. You'd get a PCR. They had results very, very quickly. And that was the PCR. That's they have the quick to take test. that and then get a... That's the, the more... The quick test, yeah. That's that. what we need. I mean, that's what you need. If you're going to mandate that, you might, it's going to be quick. But they, they had the money and they had the, the people. They had the facilities. Fast, fast, fast. Be hotel and the app will be updated. Oh, there it is. They're in the money. <laughs> but, well, I, yeah. I, I just watched your video, Darren. I got a question for you. Which video? <laughs> the premiere that was listed on the uh, highlight. Oh, okay, the car. Yeah. 1,888 horsepower. <laughs> so, it's, it's, all it's all electric, right? What yeah. the fuck are these it's guys? A why all, engine. Why are all these guys pushing it? Which guy's pushing it? Oh, that's in the uh, shop. That's in the shop. Why? I don't know. That's electric. Is it an electric rocket engine, really? Not a rocket engine. Uh, it is uh, for... 1,000 horse- 1, how many? <laughs> 1,888. And... Almost 2,000 horsepower out of an electric engine? Yeah, there's four four engines, each individual. Uh, the last ones, they're, they run two. So it's... It's, it's, too it's, much. it's, it's it's so amazing that they do Porsche as an investor. Uh, they do the electricity for Quintessig. Who's Ask driving it? Uh, they're Who's very... driving this car? <laughs> well, it's very expensive, though. Who's driving it? Who's got one? <laughs> uh, I, I would like to know. Where they did actually, you expect I to see it? And there's a dealership here in Toronto. So I'm going to... It's going to be great. So we'll see. You know where you'll see it li- live like on a public street? You'll see it where the speed limit's 30. <laughs> <laughs> speed limit 35 go slow <laughs> blah, 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 blah. I, all Rusty the Wallace. speed limits can be reduced by the cars can go faster but they reduce all the speed limits all over when I worked in Kansas Canada City right the, the, the Kansas 400 speedway is nearby so Rusty Wallace's team they brought one of the one of their show cars to my yeah. hotel for display for the race That's and cool. uh, just getting it off the truck it was like it sounded like a, an airplane it was like he's not off the truck yet he, they had the you know the rails coming down <laughs> he's it took like 10 minutes once he got to the rail it took another 10 minutes to get off the truck because <laughs> they didn't want to step on the gas <laughs> no he, he was on the brake the whole time he's like i thought the thing was gonna blow up <laughs> it sounded like a bomb <laughs> I didn't know what was going to happen. <laughs> so don't stand behind that sucker. <laughs> That's crazy. Man. There's no real lights on those cars. Those are all, it's all decals. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's true. It's so funny. When you see it up close, it's like, wow, it's not real. <laughs> it's very real. The, and they the got chassis, a cage on the inside. Well, the, body's, the body is shaped like the real car, but that's it. There's no... Yeah. There's no blinkers or lights or anything like that. No yeah. bumpers. Yeah. It's just, um, but it is it does have the shape. So, but the chassis and the and the tires and the and the uh, the drivetrain and engine, those are very real. <laughs> and oh, the windshield yeah. is real. The steering wow. wheel's real. <laughs> you know, the brakes. Really and, real. The, and the gas really pedal bad. is very real. <laughs> it's very bare on the inside. They have the roll cage and yeah. The bowl. yeah, yeah. They don't need anything else. They don't need a vanity mirror in the passenger seat. <laughs> there is no passenger seat. And That's they don't gone. need the automatic window buttons and all that, and that, and all that That's stuff. Gone. No passenger seat, nothing. They have a fire extinguisher in there. Yeah. They have a roll cage in there. They have a whole yep. bunch of buttons and gauges. And, and, and a big harness for the driver. They don't have the regular seat belts. No. Nope. Five piece harness usually. It's pretty yeah. fun. It's the minimum it was, four, but usually five. It was fun to see that come off the truck, and then they left it there for like three or four days. That's cool. Bet you lots of selfies. Right at the lots front door. Pictures. Yeah, and then the funny thing is, Rusty Wallace had the Bud Light car with the number two, the the blue blue and white. 
And guess who was checking in large group? The Jeff Gordon fans. <laughs> the Jeff Gordon fan club showed up. And I thought, I think I saw Jeff Gordon too. I didn't get to oh, talk to him. that's cool. The lobby was crowded and he's only about 5'7", right? And I, and I swear to God it was him. I looked at him and I went, hey man, how are you? <laughs> he was like, hey, how's it going? <laughs> that was about it. But he was about 10 feet from, from me, 5 or 10 feet away. But I said, that's going to be Jeff Gordon. Oh. Or it was his look like I don't know. It, it looked just like him. I saw um, Mark Wahlberg too at my my Boston hotel because Paramount was doing scene. There was a um, the oh. rental car. The rental car agency was right next to us, and they did some movie scenes there, airport scenes. Well, the, Mark Wahlberg yeah. seems pretty cool. He is cool. Um, he's from Boston. He's a Bostonian, so they chose the Boston airport for the scenes that they did it for like three days they were shooting there so they had their lunch breaks at the hotel hi Ebony it's Kid Corner good night they well, said that um, John Cena was there too but I didn't see John Cena um, but all, all the extras were there and, and Mark Wahlberg was there I forget who else was there there was one other celebrity that well known that I got a glimpse but I didn't really get up close to that person I forgot who it was they told me my co-workers told me but um, I forgot who that was. I forgot the name of the movie. <laughs> I think that's... Uh, yeah, you shouldn't forget the movie. You just uh, Google it. It'll tell you what video yeah, the movies yeah, were I'll know. Yeah, it was a couple years ago. Well, a few years now. I think it was 2018. Um, but yeah, I'll just look up Mark Wahlberg movies with John Cena. <laughs> Figure that one out real quick. He's not big either. He did a movie, The uh, Four Brothers, and um, or something like that. And he played a guy six foot four, but he's only like five eight, five nine. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, I thought he was a big guy, but when I saw him, I'm like, this guy's like my size. And uh, so. What's your average? Yeah, when I graduated high school, I was the exact average height. Yeah, they would Plus, be I've always been average or just above average. Yeah, Not the average more. has gone up. Has gone up since then, though, in the last forty years. I think it's. I still think it's the hormones they put in the, uh, the food. The food, yeah, yeah. And well, yep. kids are so much taller because inner city poor kids got taller, and it's because they were getting that food the um, from the Department of Agriculture, the um, for needy needy families, um, they were getting it the um, the powdered milk and, and that sort of thing. Um, oh no, so, not powdered milk. There was a um, a stockpile of, of powdered milk in the U.S. Really? Like, yeah. It, for emergencies? Of, the, yeah. If there was if there was a world a pandemic, they could have milk for ten, 10 or fifteen years. Oh, that's cow. a big stockpile. Yeah. Or I forget the exact. It might have been twenty years. I forget how long it was supposed to last. But the population have, keeps growing, though. They still. I think they still have a lot. Most of it. Uh, that hasn't been used. I, I think. I'm not sure about that. Well, the battery, um, I guess it doesn't expire. That's a long shelf. Well, I don't know. I don't know if it becomes contaminated, but they, that was in, they used a lot of the wheat silos to put it in. <laughs> um, the, you drive through the Midwest in the U.S., and, and after harvest, it's nothing but, it's just plain, it, there's nothing there for, from hundreds and hundreds of miles. But all you see is all you see is the empty fields like and silos. Field. There's silos every half mile everywhere, because wow. you know, have you seen you know. when they make yeah uh, those explosions with the powdered milk? No. No. Well, that's really cool. You can't get rid no, of it. No, no. They, they make a a big cannon that stands straight up. Does everybody and, get white powder on their face? <laughs> and they put like 50 pounds of powdered milk in it. And Whoa. this thing that they put it in blasts uh, high pressure air at the bottom. Yeah. And they fire the air off and they just make a spark and it blows up. Ooh. Hmm. Ooh. And a big fireball about 30, 40 feet across going up in the sky. It Ooh. burns. Pow powdered milk. So it catches Ooh. fire? Yeah. The dust is that. explosive. That's crazy. Just like, just like grain dust. Yes, oh. gotta watch out for that. Or sawdust. Sawdust is bad too. Combustible, yeah. yo. Oh yeah, it's wood. It's it's like shredded wood, but that would be like kindling. Oh, it's not good. Yes, if that catches fire, ooh, ooh, ooh. it's a good idea to start a campfire. Hey, good sawdust. night, handmade for purpose. Got one more hour. Mm -hmm. 
power. I've, I've put in security systems in a couple of places that did woodworking, and I swear to God, you look on top of the beams, there's like three quarters of an inch thick of sawdust all over the top of everything. That's dangerous. Oh, yeah. Mega dangerous. <laughs> Pour some oil on that and light a match or throw away a cigarette. You, you, you don't even need it. No. Any static. Spark, any stack or anything that makes the dust and it goes off like a bomb. Oh. Yeah. Like just... fire would just flash through there quicker than you could run. Yeah, it's instant. Instantaneous. <laughs> yeah, it's all in the air. So <laughs> why are we talking about this? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> are you gonna are you gonna sing? Not the loud. <laughs> Not allowed to talk about dangerous stuff. <laughs> we don't want anybody to, to try we're not, anything. We're not advocating starting house bonfires around here, guys. <laughs> no. <laughs> disclaimer. <laughs> disclaimer. Uh, disclaimer. No ideals for uh, something that oh, might you know go what? viral. You guys are both Canadian, right? Yeah. I'm going to do a yeah. song for you Canadians. If I can find it. I'm going to get to you guys uh, start doing that. I'm going to bring some stuff in from the car and show you what I got at the food show. <laughs> say, yeah, yeah I want this. I got a song okay. for you Canadians. This, this cat was not from the food show, and he's not food, but he's looking for tuna. He's looking for tuna? Cats are always looking for tuna, like ants are always looking for sugar. Oh, sugar, sugar. We're gonna do this one for now, anyway. You're my candy girl. Darren, the first song is always the most difficult because it's the warm up. Don't screw it up. It should be a rock song, but I don't have one ready. <laughs> yeah, get a mute. Yeah, don't screw it up, J Mike. Yeah, yeah, I screwed them all up, guys. Screw them all up. Hope you like it. Hope it comes out right. Oops, it's not right. It's wrong. I know. It's the first song is the hardest one to get started, Darren. I don't know why. All right, here we go. Are you Canadians? I'll go out to Alberta Where there's good there in the fall I got some friends that I could go to working for Still I wish you'd change your mind If I ask you one more time But we've been through this a hundred times Times or more Four strong winds that blow lonely Seven seas that run high All those things that don't change Come what may
something Canadian, I thought you were going to sing These Eyes. <laughs> These Eyes? I, you know what? That's a good one. I'll, I'll think about yeah, I know. that. These Eyes. Dun, 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 dun. I forgot about that song. And No Time? No Nancy, time. make a look, shout out. I don't usually know which songs are Canadian, which ones are American, or, or whatever, but um, I know they're talking about going to Alberta, so that's, that's why I knew that was a Canadian song. <laughs> Ah. Bare naked ladies, anything not that's Canadian. Yeah, I mean I don't I don't look to find out who the Canadian people are, although my parents are Canadian. I don't it just doesn't I, I gotta I, take Tinker out later guys. Okay. Right. See ya. Thanks Tinker's for hanging out. Man. Thanks for hanging out. <laughs> Two beers. <laughs> Two beers right there, guys. Two beers. I like to have three or four though, if I'm having a beer. I can't just have one or two. <laughs> uh, this is when you get stopped, right? Going home, it's like I had, I had two beers, officer. <laughs> yeah, blow into this. <laughs> <laughs> they never yeah, believe that's you. What they all say. I only had two beers, officer. <laughs> that's that's right. Yeah. Have you been drinking? I only had two beers, officer. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, they, we had a request for Lady. Lady? One by Kenny Rogers. Can I sing that, lady? I think I still have it on the list. I don't know. <coughs> Let me think. Lady. I think I can sing that, but not Lady Gaga. I can't do that. Lady Gaga would be very difficult. Yeah, someone asked me to do that, so it, it, I've been known to sing. Uh, <coughs> but if you're wrong. <laughs> It's not that she's a woman, it's that it's hard to sing that. Yes. That song. Yes. Did I take it out? I mean, if, sometimes if I don't sing a song, I'll take it out. <coughs> I, I, have, <coughs> I thought I had it here. I, think I could probably look it up. Well, well reminder, guys, if you haven't tam sack, make sure you tam sack. I think I'm up to 76, I think. 77. 77. How about if I do a, a different Great. Kenny Rogers song? <coughs> Classic. Oh, if I do that, you know what? Hold on, guys. Would that work? <laughs> I could do a different. <laughs> Sherry Anna, you're funny. <laughs> Damn, how come your live stream is pre recorded? Oh, there it is. <laughs> Thanks for the thumbs up, guys. Awesome. We, we always like, we love it when we get to 100. It's all up to you guys, though. We can't, we can't give ourselves 100 thumbs up. We're not that kind of, we're not that type of channel. <laughs> I will give this a shot, Darren. I don't, I'm going to let the ad run. I don't. I'm going to see if. I'm going to be in space. <laughs> <five. coughs> see who is live. Now we've got a premiere. we got a live. Keep telling myself when I'm, when I'm live, make sure you know who's live so you can give them shout outs. But then I forget. That's right. Because I'm like too busy. <laughs> All right, I 
can try this one, Dan. I don't. I never know if I can do this one, but I always try it. It's I don't, always good. I don't always try it. I have tried it a few times. So let's give it a shot. Give it a shot. Oh, wrong button. Wrong button. I do that a lot. Right. Give it a shot, guys. In a bar in Toledo, across from the depot, on a bar stroll, she took off her ring. I thought I'd get closer, so I walked on over. I sat down and asked her her name. When the drinks finally hit her, she said, I'm no quitter, but I finally quit living on dreams. Hungry for laughter, and here ever after, I'm after whatever the other life brings. In the mirror I saw him, and I closely watched him. I thought how oh, he looked out of place. He came to the woman who sat there beside me. He had a strange look on his face. The big hands were calloused, he looked like a mountain For a minute I thought I was dead But he started shaking, his big heart was breaking He turned to the woman and said He picked a fine time to leave me, Lucille Four hungry children and a crop in the field Sad times, this time you hurt and won't heal. You picked a fine time to leave me, Lucille. After he left us, I ordered more whiskey. I thought how she made him look small. From the lights of the bar room to the rented hotel room. We walked without talking at all She was a beauty But when she came to me She must have thought I'd lost my mind I couldn't hold her Cause the words I told her Kept coming back time after time He picked a fine time to leave me Lucille Find time to leave me, Lucille. For hungry children crop in the field. I've had some bad times, lived through some sad times, but this time hurting won't heal. Pick the fine time to leave me, Lucille. couldn't do that in a lower voice. I don't know why. It just had to go up. <laughs> that was still amazing. Did, did you, did it was you, awesome. You liked it, guys? Oh, yes. Yeah, it was good. Yeah, it was, yeah you I have slipped, two thumbs up. I slipped up into a higher voice and I couldn't get out. <laughs> you got was, trapped? Yeah, I, well, that's what you got to do, right? I don't know. <laughs> I couldn't, I couldn't power it in, in my lower voice. I couldn't, I couldn't do it. Sherrianna, do you think that was okay? <laughs> Thank you. All right, no more Kenny Rogers guy. I can't do it. <laughs> I can try. <laughs> what does try mean, Darren? It's not going to happen. No. <laughs> not going to happen. So how many do we have? We have 
of how to get to a thousand bananas. 76 thumbs up at a time, guys. That's how it works. 77 thumbs up. Let's go, guys. Thumbs up. Yay! Thumbs up the live stream. Because then we can do, if we do, then we're going to do those movie theme songs, you know. Oh! Like, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> You guys know, oh, you know what I want to do, Dan, if you don't mind? Sorry? If you don't mind. I don't I, mind at all. I want to do the same song I did yesterday. Where is it? It's here somewhere. Somewhere in the database. Is there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we could run right into my other song here. <laughs> Life, and so we begin foolishly laying our hearts on the table, stumbling in. Our love is a flame burning within. Now and then, fire and light will catch us stumbling.
That That's is your awesome. song. That's a cool one, right? That cool is your song. song for sure. Thank you. That's super awesome. We got Elmita still hanging out. Thanks for hanging out. Oh, yeah. yeah. Thank you, guys. I can't see the text. It's way over there. I, I do have a text here, though. Let me switch over, guys. There we go. It's there. It's there. Anpanai Vlog. Make a left shout out. Thank you. She's always hanging out. It's great. We love Anpanai Vlog right there. Absolutely. Yeah. Sherry Anna, too. Thank you so much. Sherry Anna. Elanita's Lost hanging out. Man. There's a new, a new fan live. down, El Elanita. Thanks. Hope to see you again, Elanita. We're live again tomorrow. I didn't the J Mike show. I'm in the middle of setting that up and I didn't finish it. <laughs> Hold on there, guys. Um, oh no. I'm like I, I was I was starting it like an hour ago and I forgot. <laughs> so what are we gonna call tomorrow? Um win 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 W H uh, Uh I like you type very quickly. Pretty good. I used to be able to type like 50 words a minute or more sometimes. Depends. It depends. Same time tomorrow, guys. Same bad time, same bad place. Yep, I'm gonna put this out in a second. 9, 9.30 a.m. 9.30 p.m. North America, 9.30 a.m. here in the Philippines. Let's go over to the channel. Refresh. Kill that, go here. Hot here, guys. I'm gonna check the temperature in a second. All right, oh. guys. Please go over and give this a thumbs up uh, for tomorrow. Thank you so much, guys. Please give that a thumbs up for tomorrow. Excellent. We will love you for that. Forever and ever. Forever. So, got one more song for you, Darren. That's awesome. One more song. Because we're getting to the latter part of the show, guys. Because Darren has to go to bed early because tomorrow is the charity live stream. Or not charity live stream, sorry, I mean tomorrow is working. <laughs> hey, Mary. Hello. Hey, Mary. Hello. Yeah. How are you? We're good. We're, we're singing. We are singing. I'm almost ready to start one. Oh, y'all are singing? You want, you want to hear it? Thanks for hanging out. I didn't know. What songs hey, are y'all singing? Hello, Shadow we're singing, Scout. We're singing pop songs. I just sang Stumbling In by Susie Quattro from the 70s. Um, pop songs, cool. Yeah, yeah. Here's another one, guys. Thank you so much. Thanks for hanging out, guys. It's awesome. I just wanted to come on and say hello. Sure. Awesome. Right. So stick around. Don't go away. And sugar. Ah, honey, honey, you are my candy girl, and you got me wanting you. Honey, ah, sugar, sugar, you are my candy girl, and you got me wanting you. I just can't believe. Loveliness of loving you. I just can't believe it's true. I just can't believe the wonder of the 
this feeling too. I just can't believe it's true. Ah, sugar. Ah. Sugar, you are my cake and you got me wanting you. When I kissed you, girl, I knew how sweet a kiss could be. I know how sweet a kiss can be. Like the summer sunshine, pour your sweetness over me. Nice song, Jay. Thank you, thank you, guys. Great job, Jay. Thank you. Thank I liked your cat buddy. behind you. Yeah, it's Toby. Darren, Darren's got that cat problem going on. <laughs> <laughs> I used to have a cat, but I don't know more. Yeah, Jay yeah, has a rooster cats. problem. He comes over, but the dog <laughs> takes care of it. <laughs> or a chicken, maybe? I don't know. Here's a rooster? I don't know. The dog has a rooster problem. <laughs> Hello, Ann. <sighs> I, I like that song. I, don't know what to do I was anymore. dancing to it. Yeah, everybody loves that song, especially if you're like over what forty or fifty. I don't know. Sure, the young, kids, I young, know the young kids like it. Damn it, I can keep going. I got all these great songs popping up. They're like right in the right order. Sure, go for it. Mr. Dynamite is here? Kidding me? Where? Where is he? Did I miss him? If he's here, make a love shout out, Mr. Dynamite. Awesome. 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 All right. I can keep going, I think. I think I can do it. Oh, rock and roll. Mate, yeah, it's rock, all right. This is a rock song. Classic. It's a classic, guys. People stay. People stay. Just a little bit longer. Don't mind 
If we take a little time and we leave it all behind and sing one more song. Song goes out to Sherry Anna, Tammy Trot. Thanks for hanging out, girls. On Penine Block 14. Thank you. That's awesome, Jay. Yeah, my brother's rock group down. I mention that from time to time. Um, cool song. They used to cover that song. They did a good job on it. The bass player would do the opening part, and then um, they had a girl. They had a girl to do the other vocals, the high part. Oh, well, you got your mango smoothie. Hey, next I thought it, was, it looked like orange juice. The mangoes, it's, a, it's mango and crust ice not, with nothing else. Um, the so mangoes good. are falling out, out of the sky here. <laughs> I, I love set. mangoes. We have two huge mango trees and two different kinds of mangoes. But they're all good. They're all sweet. And a shout out to Alona Tempos in the house. Mega love shout out. Elsa, mega love shout out. How are you doing, Shadow? I'm doing good. He's great. What time is it over there where you are, Shadow? 5.58 a.m. Coming up on 6 o'clock in the morning. You're from Scotland? Sweden. Sweden. Sweden, Sweden Switzerland, and Scotland I all get mixed up. Jerry Boy's from Scotland, our, our old friend Jerry Boy TV. He's from yes, Scotland. we saw him earlier on Josh. I saw him earlier on Josh's channel with Lone Wolf. Oh, I missed it. I would have gone over there. I missed it. Yeah, give, you were give probably my, give them my apologies. Because it's funny, like I say, you don't get notifications all the time. So it was like yeah. bouncing from Blessed Life and Christy Angelo before I got Blessed Life was on Josh. And, uh, yeah, there's lots, lots of people to visit and support. Cool, yeah. <laughs> there's so many. Yeah, no kidding. There's 3,000 of them, Darren. <laughs> More than that. Oh, oh, I'm over 5,000. <laughs> but, <laughs> but I get a, a lot, I get slowly, slowly switch them just to Bell. Because there's <laughs> too many, except for my people that are really... Support, support, because yeah, too so many it's notifications. Not, it's not humanly possible. You're too busy. You're doing your own live streams. Yeah. I could do it 24-7 and still wouldn't have enough time. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Yeah, this is gotta... impossible. Yeah, you just can't do it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so I, got, I, got I see small... your cat sleeping now behind you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> He'll wake up one day and goes to sleep. Hello, them son. Hello, Hello. 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 Hi. How are you? Hello, nice to meet you. I'm doing good. Good. Where Where are you from, Malona? 
I am Philippines. Philippines. But she's in yes, the but now, but right now I am in uh, Middle East in uh, Abu Dhabi. Yes. I'm in America, United States. Oh, okay, nice, nice, nice to meet you too. I live in Nashville, Tennessee. You are in Tennessee. Nashville is a beautiful yeah. town. David Hewitt lives in Nashville. Yeah, I got a southern accent. I'm so southern, I talk like Forrest Gump. You sound like <laughs> some of my cousins. I talk like Forrest Gump, I swear. Oh, uh, yeah. Have, Nashville's cousins, beautiful. Mary, I have cousins in Virginia, and they, they have that accent. They say, what he, what's his name, Darren? I cannot read. I cannot read. What's his Mary? name? What's his name? Mercy? Mary. Mary. Ah, uh, Mary, do you have channel? Yeah, but I don't do videos or anything. I got like eight subscribers. Jay uh, and Darren are one of them. She is a supporter. Oh, whoa. Yes. Yeah, I come on every now and then. Mary, I subscribed a long time ago. I don't know if it's still there. Sometimes yeah, YouTube... it's still there, I think. Yeah. Sometimes YouTube takes it away. I don't know why. They took me, they unsubscribed me from my own wife. That's you horrible. Me from Darren Dobson, the horrors. <laughs> Got you some Cheetos, popcorn. I just got a subway. message from YouTube you. and it said, uh, "I don't eat Cheetos." <laughs> Did you go grocery shopping, Darren? <laughs> well, I was at the food show today, so we got all these we got all these gifts. This is four different drinks in this box. He packaged them to me. <laughs> so that's kind of cool. Day your birthday, Darren. Today's not my birthday. Here's a we got a different kind of non-alcoholic beers. Oh, this is like it was like a, a gift box from Pepsi. Dubson, <laughs> the, the by the way, Dubson, we knew which which date you go to Philippines next month. I, I arrive on June the eighth. June eighth. I will. Uh, my flight is my flight is July seven. July seven? Okay, I'll be gone by then. Well, what are you doing in the Philippines? What are you going to do in the Philippines, Darren? Me, I'm going to be doing covering hotels, resorts, charity work, and visiting other YouTubers. Yeah, I'm having a party on June eleventh. Me and Norman, we're going to have karaoke outside, out in the yard, and. Um... We've got, we got banana trees and mango trees and palm trees. It's going to be a beautiful breeze. I'm going to vacation because it's been a long time. I'm not, because of COVID, okay. it's almost four years. I'm not going, I'm not, see, I didn't see to my mother. Almost four years. Wow, I know. Alona, why are you so late? You're supposed to be earlier. <laughs> not not oh after I <laughs> You're supposed to be there when I'm there. Okay. No, because Darren, I, 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 uh, actually, this is my vacation is so early, but uh, I have some job during for me in this coming May 21 until June 21. Ah, I have a job, so nice. What does that say, Darren? Show me, show that again up close. Ginlet. So it's a different company that does. Ooh, I, uh, I, thought, I thought that was UNICEF. <laughs> no, Jim Let's. That's good. I got a gift bag with some. Dabson. Never heard of, yeah. never heard of Jim Let's. Dabson. It's okay, Dabson. We, we, even we don't, we don't see. Uh, what is this? Even, even you and me don't, don't see there in Philippines. It's fine. It's okay. No problem. <laughs> Here's this healthy thing called Well, really high What's end. That? Well, it's a it's a well greens healthy drink. Well, wellness. Yeah, wellness, and it's really good. So it's Wellness Greens, and it's uh, manufactured in Toronto. So you shake it. It's Made in Toronto, it can't be good. Ah, but it is. <laughs> <laughs> Not possible. Like an energy but, drink. But Dabson, when when you gonna uh, what which date you co come back? You you come back to the to in Canada. Uh, I leave on the June the fifth. Come back. So how many weeks you are there? Four mm -hmm. weeks. Yeah, Only one month. 
on July oh, oh. 4th. It's coming back on the 4th of July. You're going to be here, Darren. The fireworks are crazy. So uh, I can't catch you there. I can't miss you because Actually, my flight is July. We don't, Philippines doesn't celebrate the 4th of July, Darren. Uh, see y'all later, guys. I'm going to bed. Bye, Mary. It's Thanks 11 o'clock. Mary, bye. Thanks for hanging out, bye. Mary. Take care, Thank Mary. You, Mary. Stay safe. Thank you. Thank you. God Thank bless. You. Look at all these different uh, samples, samples. <laughs> now, where did you get free samples? Are they trying to promote themselves? Yeah, so I'm, a, I'm a journalist. Right. So, so they want to, so remember I'm going to be doing events. So we're looking for a product for events to give out for free because people have to sample before they buy. Right. Hi, Brad. They don't let you do that here, Darren. You got to buy it. Before you sample it, <laughs> yeah, it's you crazy. gotta try it. If you like it, then it's good. Yeah, so it's pretty good. So I got lots of samples. Good stuff. Now show the package one more time. Show that bottle. So this is uh, chocolate milk. Oh, what's the name of it? That's Millionaire, right. you. What do you mean? Not you need help. Banana. You need banana? I need, no, a, I need like I need a thousand bananas. Millionario, I don't have banana. I have only <laughs> binka. <laughs> Bibinka. I'll take that. <laughs> Darren is only have banana and G Mike and Shadow Shadow Shadow? Shadow Scout. Shadow Scout Swede. Yeah, that's me. Look at all these different things. Chips and Doritos. Millionario, if you want banana, I'm gonna to slook you, okay? <laughs> this is excellent gonna... water. Seven Pellegrino water? Yeah. Yeah, it's good. That's good water, so I got that. Oh, that's good. Millionario is, he has 817. So, can you help help in the soon? Help you? We gotta, help got to. Help him, not me. <laughs> Word Guys, chips. connect connect with Alona. She's got like eight thousand subscribers. <laughs> Alona, what? Are you in chat? Are you we in chat? spicy ketchup. What you might? You have like eight thousand subscribers, right? Well, she has thirteen. No, way more than that. So are you in chat? Thirteen. Type love, Alona. Type love. If not. Probably, probably a call. No, it's not. That's not you. Jimai, Jimai, I'm always. I've been very busy, Jimai. Start from Ramadan. Very busy. Oh. Nick's coins. Sorry, we missed you. Make a left shout out, Nick. There is, uh, there is. It's not busy. Always in the, in the, in the life. Joe and Jane. <laughs> busy helping other people. How are you doing, Joe? Me too. You know, I'm so very busy. Me, I'm so busy. <laughs> I know you're busy. My Dude, life is no have chance to get a happy life. Uh, yeah, uh, always not happy. <laughs> what do you mean you're always not happy? That's not good. Always not happy. No. There's a popsicles. And this lady has these beautiful popsicles here. Ah, uh, millionario, I dig it you hard. I already to slope you in my pobre ako. <laughs> so, but don't watch my video, ha, millionario, because it's naked. <laughs> Demonetized. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's Jerry, not monetized, so. It's so naked. <laughs> hey, Finesse Habit. Finesse, make a love shout out, Finesse. So the yeah, that's done. Stream... That's done. Yeah. You see my legal challenge? <laughs> no, not yet. So, so let it... I blocked you, Block. <laughs> so... <Huh? laughs> Good to see you, Penis. You black me? Oh my gosh. <laughs> we gotta be he careful. Just, just kidding, guys. Just have fun only. Life is too short. 
But I am not flirt, ha? I am not malandi, Dubson. Huh? I am not malandi. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, Olona, on Saturday is uh, May 14th, is the, uh, the uh, charity anniversary live stream. So, okay. Hi, Darren. Make sure all your all your sure. friends come. Hey, Alona. Yes. Alona. Yeah. I miss you. Kanina pa ako nagbe-message sa you. I miss you too. <laughs> yeah, I'm not feeling well, Darren. I'm in my bed. Oh my god. Oh no. Yeah, I know. Well, I'm glad oh, you're feeling well enough too. to come up and say hi to us. That looks good. Yeah, I just want to say hello to all of you, okay? And, uh. Hello. Yeah. Love, shout out to Pinasa, Are you okay, yeah. sir? Yeah, I'm not so much. I feel dizzy because of last night. Because I'm. I, I'm cramming now because I, I need to finish the artwork that I'm going to give it to my friend of mine. I have lack of sleep. Ah, lack of sleep. That's not good. Yeah. Oh, another, I got another charger. Look at that. I got another portable charger. That's cool. Yeah. Wow. Darren, you collect you collect all the freebies. <laughs> all the all the freebies. This is great. Oh my now, god. You're gonna do a video and give them a shout out too, right? And talk about their product, right? That's what. The, that's the idea. <laughs> Yeah, of course. The, uh, that's that's why I'm showing everybody now. They have to rewatch this. <laughs> you have a son. You have a son. I just, in 20 minutes, I'm going to have to go down because someone's calling me work. Okay, I miss we'll you, come. Alona. Alona. We only uh, have 20 minutes left. I still, rem I still remember when Murad is alive. <laughs> yeah. Me too. <laughs> I for making fun of Morat. Morat, I, Murat, Murat, I love you, Morat. <laughs> no, it's Dobson. 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 What? Dobson. What? Dobson. Yeah. Okay, guys. Uh, I, I I have to jump off now because uh, I I just want to say hello to all of you, especially to you, J Mike. Thank you very much last yesterday and also to you, Darren. And uh, yeah, yeah, J. Mike, tomorrow you have a live stream. Yes, so go ahead and give that a thumbs up. It's already. It's yeah, already I will. Uh, I, I will come up to you. Okay. Hello, Ati Norma. <laughs> Hello. Okay, I gotta go now. Bye, Shadow Street, Darren, and Alona. Take care. Okay, bye. Take care, okay, share. okay, bye. Okay, bye. Share pencil, everybody. She's in a rush. To, it was good that she came up, though. That was very friendly. Pina, see that? Share pencil setting the exam. Girl, my jewelry, lovers, I decate you already. I post look you already. <clears throat> so, Alona, I have a song for you. Okay. Yep. Don't Darren, cry, Lona. Darren's gonna love it. Eighty-four thumbs up. I will not cry, Dobson. For, for you will be I crying. So this this one goes out to Lona. Ready, guys? Let's get it going on. Let's do it. <clears throat> it broke my heart. Cause I couldn't dance. You didn't even want me around. And now I'm back to let you know I can really shake him down. I do you love me? I can really move. I do you love me? I'm in the
to try that <laughs> oh, shadow that would, be, that would be a story if you did that that would be super awesome i wonder which song sal's gonna swing on his make sure what? you practice in the shower first <laughs> all right there's a reason why it comes out good in the shower <laughs> is there because of the echo Oh. That's a smaller part. There's a bigger reason, but that is that is true. Oh, really? Yeah, but the, yeah, there's a bigger reason. The um, the water vapor, um, the humidity in your sinuses is the big reason. Because oh. I keep feeling like I either need a sip of water or I need to swallow, but I can't. You can't do that while you're singing because it it takes too long and it gets in the way. Oh. And then and then your your throat's contracted and it's no good. You can't do that. Oh. So you, have, you have to spit and drool. <laughs> it's all of science. Yeah, it's reality. <laughs> well, mango smoothie. <laughs> How many do you drink every morning? Uh, it's not every morning, but uh, it's, it's usually yes, more, more than half the morning. I will do uh, mute because I have to prepare myself. Are you going to change clothes? Siggy, siggy, ball. She's going to chase what? <laughs> She's going to chase clubs. I, Night, I'm going to change my pump fever. <laughs> She's going to change clothes. Oh. I'm the, going to where, change my panty because I have work. I have part time. Wear the, the panty with the little bow in front on the, on the waistline. <laughs> I know Jima, she's got one. Jima, I know she has those. Don't, Jima, don't, don't decay my capobre because there is a lot of naked there. <laughs> don't care. You love the double care. <laughs> Everybody connect to Ben's uh, blogs. Ben should go to Pinas Habit, Superstar. Connect with Pinas, guys. Tammy Trot, super supportive. Glad everything's back to normal, Tammy Trot. Going to be fun. <clears throat> I'm having fun singing today, Dan. We're going to demonetize your live stream. You're going to be 10 cents poorer. <laughs> what are you, how many of your songs? I had 30 the other day. Cleaning out, cleaning all the live stream. I only had one yesterday, right? And I had 30 oh. two days before that. 30, I left that alone. <laughs> oh, good. Yesterday, the, the only one that was that was claimed was uh, Walk the Line by Johnny Cash. Oh, okay. I walked the line. I didn't even think I sang it very well either. The song. Soon, I have I, I PM you hard. This is first time I PM you in the messenger. I want to tell you something. <laughs> wow, never mind. It's not. What's this picture? I just, I just want to tell. I just want you ask. I just asking you something. What's this picture? <laughs> huh? <laughs> <laughs> Tell Tony, you are Playboy. Yeah, Playboy. I thought we had this agreement. No pictures. <laughs> you are still Playboy, huh? 
Eu sou tribo e dubção. Não! Not allowed. Not allowed, yes. Like me, not allowed, boyfriend. No allowed. I'm done this play, boy. No comment. No comments. Look at me, I am play girl, but just only the play girl. <laughs> <laughs> just play no work. Yes, just play no work, no benefits. It's all good. It's all good. Dabs on, play. How long on? What's going on? All the bang. Can you jam? I gotta check. Okay, Nixon, I have to go now. I will do mute. Sigi, sigi. Okay. Okay, Po. Chimai, so, you are out. See you later. Okay, Thank you. Help. Don't, we did. Don't, don't forget about we us. Around. See you around alone. Don't, don't forget about us. Be safe. Dabs on. Bye-bye. Be safe. Wag kalimutan ka. Wag kalimutan ka. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. I may not have said that exactly right, Darren, but she knows what I meant. Yeah. That's the funny thing with Filipinos. They don't speak properly or correctly, but they know what each other means. It's unbelievable. That's good. Yeah, but it, it, becomes, it becomes a common common everyday slang, and then everybody everybody does it the same way. It's actually, Google understands it better than the proper, proper Tagalog. <laughs> it's weird. Yeah. Uh, because they're... Uh, with Google, what happens is you verify phrases on Google, and then that's what they're doing. <laughs> so Google thinks the language is different. Wow. They say it's right, but it's just what the way they understand. Oh. <laughs> so Darren's eating. While Darren's eating and Nuts. flexing, I will sing. I'm going to do a different backing track. I hope this works. It always works, Jay. I hope it works. Yeah, well, I, I figured out how to make a lot of it work, but not all of it. Not all of it. Yeah. Yeah. That's what it's all about. Why isn't that playing? Why? Why? Why?
regular show. Thank you, Sherry Anna, Jamie Trump. Thank you so much. Oh. God is great, yeah, yeah, God is good, yeah, 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 yeah. What if God was one of us, just a slob like one of us, just a stranger? Is a great song. Right, Sean Williams. What do you think? Yeah, you like it too. And Sherry Anna. Yeah, yeah. I know Sherry Anna likes it. Is Tammy great. <coughs> thank, thank you. Yeah. Th thanks, Tammy. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Super awesome. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. There we go. Ruby's here. Hey, Ruby. Can you make a left shot? Yeah. Sean Williams here. Ruby's here. Sweet Sammy dreams. Trot. Sweet dreams with Gosha is here. Awesome. Yeah. Little, I see little, Jamie little, Trot. And Sherry Ann. Thank you, Sherry Ann. Thank you so much. Linda Lou. Everybody's here. Wow. Toby's here, too. <laughs> Awesome, Toby. Toby's hanging out. Shadow's hanging out. Took uh, alone is hanging out. Try to do something with that echo, guys. Sorry about that. Ah, the echo is gone. Yeah, it's awesome when you yeah. sing though. It's like surround sound. You have to turn on two things. The echo. Do you have to turn on surround sound, echo, and when you turn it off? Here's what I do. Like, here's what I do. When I'm starting, I, I go to um, StreamYard settings, go to audio, and then I, I get rid of the echo cancellation and I turn on stereo audio. Ah. Then I go back to the sound card and, and take it out of acoustic and I put it into... The, this sound card calls it Sonic Boom, but it's the happy mode. And um, it's got different modes. That, it's hard to tell the difference, but I just put it there. <laughs> and then I add, I add like 50% reverb. That's a different uh, slider, and then, then I have the um, the, the uh, mic level. That's it. Oh, and then the um, not too complicated. The the, um, the music channel on YouTube that I use, that has to be all the way up on volume. Yeah. So so my first song, it's always off because I'm running videos, and sometimes I, if I'm watching two, I'll put one on on no volume, and then I. I always screw up and start thinking with that off, <laughs> that all the way down. Yeah. Or it's not all. It's, like, it's on very low. Thanks Tammy for the super yeah. sticker. Yeah. Yay! Hey, Tammy! Thank you so much. R W is that R W? I can't see. Tammy Trot. R W zero six. R W oh six. Debson, friends. Debson, I have to bye bye now, Debson. Okay. Bye. Thank you so much, Alona, for coming up. Bye, Lona. It's good to see bye, you. Bye, bye, Lona. See you around. Bye. No more setting pictures. Not allowed. <laughs> no. <laughs> bye. Not allowed. <laughs> uh, of course, not allowed because Darren already take it. Yeah. Oppo. Yeah, Sherry, I speak. 
Bye, bye, guys. Kagiatan RW uh, video. Oh, it's Mukbang. See, they're having, they're having the Shadow Scout always looks like he's ready to sing. But he Chicken says that. Noodles. <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> looks he's ready for that. Participation. <laughs> it looks like he's getting ready to give us the weather report. It's like now, <laughs> now over to weather with Shadow <laughs> Scout Swede. <laughs> What's it going to be like today? <laughs> Sunday. <laughs> well, he well, looks like ball ball. In Scandinavia, it's going to be a little cold and breezy, but not too bad. You know. <laughs> Probably. Great day for hiking. Yeah. Now, in foreign news, the uh, Philippines elected the former, the son of the former president, uh, Marcos. Yeah. Marcos Jr. <laughs> How that happened? I don't know. It's none. Nah, it's they good it's, about, they it's, none of, it's not my duty to vote here. I gotta, I can't get involved in that. <laughs> That's but, the one thing foreigners are not allowed. No, you'd have to actually switch your passport to a Philippine passport, which America allows dual. Not allowed. Not allowed. America is allowed. I could forfeit if I become a citizen here. I could forfeit my um, my social security. I can't do that. No, because Amer America is messing with everybody, and they're, and they're messing with their citizens, and then they're pretending to be friends with foreigners and people that are trying to sneak in. So it doesn't make sense. It's not. It's not all of America. America's divided. There could be a civil war. It'll. It'll be. A, it'll be a, a war of the typewriters or the. Um, you know the thumbs. The. Um, the messaging. This it's, is the USA or the Philippines. It's absurd. The USA. The USA is d totally divided. I know. But it's to me, small. in my opinion, in my opinion, it's it's divided between people who who accomplish things and people who are, um, don't make sense. No. Okay. <laughs> That's the problem. But the people who don't make sense are fighting. They're fighting a different kind of a battle. It's weird. It's very weird. Because we're more similar than we are different. There's a battle. You're right. We 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 all have everything's in common. But there's something weird going on in 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 politics, and it's it's the LGBT. I don't know why they're doing this. It's and now there's a fight over abortion. Now, in in I my know. opinion. Right. Uh -oh. It's probably a scientific fact. Why are gays getting involved in that? They don't get each other pregnant. That is true. So why are they why are they fighting for abortion? I don't get it. It's like it's not. It shouldn't be an issue. Didn't they say yesterday? What if I were an abortion? <laughs> I wouldn't have, be able to say this. <laughs> someone said someone was on the news saying thank. They were screaming in Congress. Thank God for abortion. Oh, they were on MSNBC, I forget. Thank God for abortion. And the hosts were smiling. Oh, it's like, God. no, it's the, it's, the other, it's the other way around. Thank God you weren't an abortion. That's what you should be saying. Thank God I wasn't an abortion. It's absurd. It's ludicrous. <laughs> it's, uh, it's insane. <laughs> it's insane. It's unbelievable. I, I can't believe that that exists, that argument. And, and it's in the media. No comment. <laughs> it's a, yeah, you're playing it safe, which means that, you, uh, <laughs> which makes you weak, Darren. If you if you never have a comment, you know, that makes you weak. It makes you appear. I'm weak. just being smart. No, I, yeah. Oh, so someone don't come after you. It's funny if someone comes after me, ask me some questions. Scientifically, gays and lesbians don't get each other pregnant. No, if you're truly gay and lesbian, then you're never going to get pregnant. If you're truly true to your word, your own word. You're never going to get pregnant. So why are you screaming about abortion rights? Mm. I don't get it. I don't get it. Maybe they support their friends. But I, what I do know is people that have had abortions, if a woman, if a young woman never has a baby and, but she has abortions, it's a known fact, it's a medical fact that she, that she will run into health problems before she's 40 or 50 years old. She'll have trouble living long. Oh, she'll Ariana. have serious issues as she gets older. Yeah, oh. it'll shorten your life. Um, because naturally, your body is naturally meant to go through that. Um, I'm not putting numbers on it, but there are there can be medical issues down the road. Oh. Uh, with, in health, he psychologically and physically, you can have issues. Oh. Uh, you, you're not supposed to be, uh, do that to your body. You're not. You're just not. Um, it's it's not like putting a nose ring on yourself. It's different. Ooh. And, you're, you know, in, I, I had a boss that said, well, I'm a man, so I have no say. Well, yes, you do, because you're half the parent. You're, you're half of that um, unborn baby's parents. 
Ooh. So many, there's so many um, men in the world that are named Junior. And most of them have the, the talents of their father. You see it in entertainment and you see it in, in pro sports, right? Yeah. Um, like Ken Norton Jr., his father was a heavyweight champion boxer and the son was an NFL football player. And he, he has a Super Bowl ring. Uh, he played for a couple of, two or three teams. It took right after his father, you know. Um, That's cool. But, you know, I don't, I don't wish jail or death on anyone that's had an abortion, but I just don't, you know, the argument that you're seeing on left-wing news is, is like absurd. There is yeah. actually crazy drug addicted people screaming about it in front of the, um, you know, somewhere in, in Washington. Um, they're not making sense. They're just acting like, they're acting like they're being killed at war. <laughs> I didn't want a war. People are very passionate. They don't know what they're talking about. People get very passionate. If I I know they're living um, ridiculous lives. Um, they should be, try to improve themselves instead of um, making fools of themselves. They're not going to ever have a better life out there screaming in public. You won't. They won't get anywhere. It's people that don't get go anywhere. They don't accomplish a thing. And I'm talking about the people that are that are making public demonstrations. I'm not talking about everybody, but there is there is a poor mentality that will keep you poor, and then you'll always hate the rich, even though you'll vote for somebody that's very rich. <laughs> it's it's it, and and then you're in favor of the athletes making more than a hundred million dollars. It's it's like absurd. And then you want to break the back of the people that that are um, keeping it going. Yeah. It's, we just we just do silly things. Can't have that we do. We do. We do. We do. It's like I, it leads me to say you get people need, should be more careful what they what they wish for. Well, you never know what the consequences or differences will be. Oh no! I don't want that on. I don't know why it's so noisy. It's noisy. Good for you. Got the air conditioning on. No, I'm shutting it off. It's too noisy. I don't know why. The thing was quiet when I bought it. Oh, really? Yeah, it was more quiet. Well, maybe it's, it's always been this close to the to the mic. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> uh, I don't know. So let's see. I am on RW6 channel watching this long video. It's almost over. Nice. Yeah, it's yeah. awesome. Joe, awesome. and Jenny Journey. Awesome. Joe and Jenny Journey, I'm on your channel. I don't see your live stream scheduled. What, what's, what happened, Joe? He hadn't reset the time. It, uh, it was already live, and it went over that time. I thought he already did that, but now I don't see it at all. Yeah. No, because if you don't touch it, it stays there like um, upcoming yesterday. That's what it Correct. But it's, but it's gone, so he took it down. I don't, I don't know why. Oh. Guys, you got to go forward with your plan, so you can't do that. Um, because it it won't help you. It it just it just kills you. It's like shooting. Yeah, it's it's like shooting yourself in the foot. You 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 want to get started. You tell everybody you're getting started, and then you, you reschedule it, and then you don't reschedule it. And it's like you know the old the old movies where the guy shoots himself in the foot because <laughs> he can't get the gun out of his holster. <laughs> it's like uh, that's like shooting yourself in the foot. I've done that. And, um, that's the reason we don't grow, or, or we say we're gonna do, you know, something, and then we don't do it. That's the old "I'll try." <laughs> you could could do this, or you could do that, and then that might help your channel. Okay, I'll try, and then it doesn't happen. So, you do um, or don't. It doesn't happen. So do what you know is gonna work, guys. Um, I, I, he might have. He might have um, hoped that, that that would work. I don't know. I'm just speculating. Like, I think we can make this happen. You just got to do it. Do something else. Um, whatever it is. Up, up. Up, up. Yeah. They don't say that too much here. I have heard some people say it, but they, they don't. it's not a frequent thing to say Opal. You say, uh-oh. Uh -oh. Two O's? Uh -oh. oh, 
Yeah, it's like yeah. it's like something funny happens, like oh, spaghetti, oh, you know, something like that's what that's what I keep thinking they're saying, but they're just saying yes. Like when yeah. I'm in conversation, if somebody if they're saying yes, 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 they, they say that a lot. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I mean, I mean, they won't sit there and go oh, oh, oh they won't do that. But <laughs> you, you you hear that a couple of times every in every um, conversation. Oh, 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 yeah. <laughs> they don't say yeah. They don't say yeah. They say oh, oh, oh. They never say yeah. They know what yes means, but they, I don't hear them saying yeah, yeah, yeah. They well, they know it. Yeah, yeah. When we sing, we sing. Yeah. yeah. They know yeah. what that means, but they just yeah. it doesn't it doesn't pop off their lips like yeah. uh, like it does for us. Oh, it's so, it was quick. Yeah. So uh -oh. it's hard to get used to that. Like I, I know it means yes, but when I hear it, it's like oh wait a minute, <laughs> that means yes. <laughs> oh, <sighs> the lyrics. I think it's great. Yeah. <laughs> Shadow could probably learn Tagalog quicker than us because we talk too much. <laughs> We're yeah. talking when he's listening. <laughs> yeah, and Shadow's, Shadow knows Swedish, he knows English. We don't know what other languages he knows. Um, what's up there? What about Norwegian? <laughs> oh, wow. He's not sure talking. Different. Hey, Swede, is Norwegian uh, similar or close to... Swedish? It's uh, similar, but uh, they have different words. Hmm. That's like the um, the dialects here in in Philippines. They understand each other a little bit, but it's not all the same. There's there are some basic words in Filipino that they all that they all know. But they don't speak that that simply. They're more advanced than J. Mike. <laughs> I don't. I haven't studied every day. I, I was I was doing like an hour a day, but I'm not doing that anymore. So a lot of what I've learned, I, I'm forgetting the meaning of everything. Just like, like riding a bicycle, you get back it's on. A lot, it, it's a lot of familiar words, but I see. I say, well, I've heard that word in my lessons, but now I forget exactly what it means. <laughs> so, yeah. I have to, so I haven't done any reviews. I was going to do it this morning, but I did something else. No. So that's the thing. It's hard to learn everything at once. You can't do that. Hey, blessed life is in the house. 91 ups. So Go what do they say? Hey, bless. LS. I was looking bless. forward to seeing bubbles or teddy bear. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry for the silent life. Oh, yeah, I, you did that before and I made a short out of it. <laughs> Bliss answers the phone while on live stream and the wheel was there. <laughs> the wheel was turning around, putting names on the wheel. <laughs> you went to a Starbucks uh, meeting, so. And you left it live? <laughs> yeah, I, I, I was making a comment in there. I was like, is this a silent live stream? What's going on here? <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> oh, those mango smoothies. I got to pee, guys. I'll be right back. <laughs> See our break. I know. I'll be right back, guys. <laughs> that's what That's what happens. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, when Jay comes back, it's almost time for me to end. It's three hours and 16 minutes. But uh, right here in Toronto, it's 1246 a.m., so I'll get some sleep, and then get up, and then go back to the food show again. Lots, lots of people to see. <laughs> more people to see. More filming to do. But yeah, it's all good. It's all good. <laughs> Speaking of languages, uh, I know a few words in Japanese. Ah. Tell, tell us some. Which ones do you know? Uh, konnichiwa. Ah. Arigato. Arigato. Domo arigato. Uh, mm. Mushi mushi. But that is... Uh, the mushi mushi is when you speak in the phone. On the phone. When you call someone. You say oh. mushi mushi. <laughs> it means... Um, hello, good day, or... Okay. Very good. Guten Tag means good day in German. Yeah. So. I uh, have uh, studied German when I was in the school. 
Ah, okay. But uh, I I wanted to uh, study French because I had more. I considered you have more use of French than German. Mm -hmm. So I didn't. Did you learn uh, French? No. Okay. And hi is uh, yes on Japanese. Ie is no. Very good. There he is, J. Mike. He is back. Yeah, J. is back. <laughs> Everyone in French at school. <laughs> Welcome back. Sorry about that, guys. It's getting hot in here. <laughs> you turn on the air conditioner again. Make sure you dump, dump the water. No. No, I just went to point the fan at me. If it's oh, that'll work. Yeah, the fan's okay. You need moving air when it's hot, guys. Yeah, airflow is really good. Really important, yeah. I don't mind the heat. I just have to have some air on me. Doesn't need to be cold. Air, yeah, <laughs> air, so it's, it's, I think you're right. Just a nice breeze. Yeah. Hmm. that's The thing that makes you feel hot is that, that you need to blow air over your skin. Yeah, because the your body naturally naturally perspires. There's heat you right on your skin. You're gonna, you're gonna breathe it away. Nice. It's the it's the vapor of your perspiration that makes you feel hot. Oh, okay. Yeah, humidity humidity is what makes you feel hot. That's why they, they yeah say feel it's ninety two, but it feels like a hundred. That's what the, because the humidity, humidity. Yeah. And then in, with the cold, it's the speed of the wind. Wind chill. Ooh, yeah. Then, then wind chill is at least 10 degrees so colder. It's 32, but it feels 20. Or it's four above for zero, but it feels like two below. Yeah. You know, or two, you know, negative two, however they say it. So, you know. All right, Shadow's going to sing. Ready, guys? Yay! What, ha what have you picked Who up, said Shadow? that? Well, Jay Mike said it. You can do it, Bobby Boucher. I see Jay Mike's gonna pick out a song. So oh, he's singing along with me. So that's what I'm gonna do. No, I'm gonna sing a song. Because... Just jump in when you know it, guys. Just jump in. That was a good one. She packed my bags last night. Pre-flight Zero hour 9 a.m. And I'm gonna be high As a kite by then I miss the earth so much Miss my wife. It's lonely out in space on such a timeless flight. And I think it's gonna be a long, long time. Touchdown brings me real. And there's no one there 
to raise them If you did And all this science I don't understand It's just my job Five days a week I work at me Yeah. It just fades. See you guys. <laughs> Sherry and I, I never sing Oh What a Night. I used to play it as a DJ, though. The, um, the dance beat version from 1991, the, 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 the newest version. That was awesome. That song had to come back after uh, like 30 years, 20, 25 years or something like that. It had a major comeback in the clubs. That became a club classic. That was that song was like one of my pride and joy records right there. Oh, what a night! I don't know if I can sing it now. <laughs> a long, long time. Yeah. Um, I never knew I could sing. I never knew. See that shadow? Write that down. J. Mike never knew that he could sing. <laughs> you know how to you do it? You you do it one. One, one phrase at a time. You pick a song that you really love, and then you work on it one phrase at a time. It's a mistake a lot of people make. They they don't learn the first phrase, and then they get off to a shaky start, and then and then they they get the chorus very well, but then the song isn't perfect. Thanks, Francis Ting. Thank you. Thank you for the comment. Um. My chat's way over there, so it's hard to see it. But anyway, um, the first phrase and then the chorus. Obviously, the chorus is, is key. But, and a lot of songs have a cadence change in the chorus that you have to be aware of. You have to actually have to work on that. Because um, some songs seem easy, but then there's a cadence change in, which makes the song great, and then it, sometimes we miss it, and then it... That's, and the, we know it. If you're singing it, you know you missed it. And then maybe you, you're good at the chorus or whatever. And um, just stuff that a good singer will be aware of that. Thanks, Timmy. Yeah, it's fun singing. You, when you sing a song that like that, you know if it's if it feels like fun, you know it's gonna come out good. So. Um, Sweet dreams, thank you so much. Thanks for saying that. Um, 
my voice is amazing. Yeah, I always had a, I well, hated my well, voice, but I just some songs just work for me because I I figure it out and. Uh, it, it's yeah, there you are, Darren. I am good. Getting so, ready. Two more so minutes. Darren, three and a half hours, Darren. Yeah, the sun's shining here. It's a beautiful day here. It's yes. beautiful. And it's, it's dark dark outside here in Toronto. It's, <laughs> it's breezy. Let's check. It yeah, out. and the sun is up here. A nice breeze going on, guys. Hey Siri. What's the local temperature? It's about 91 degrees outside. It's beautiful. Not bad. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. It's sunny, partly cloudy, and breezy. That means it's going to be nice to step outside, nice and warm. Perfect. It is humid here where, in, where I am anyway. So. Do, you, do you tan your feet? Yes, Jay, Jay, my... I have my feet are getting tanned. My lower legs, my feet, my arms. No, Very my good. face. No, my face. Not, not too much up here. I don't take the shirt off a lot just for a few minutes here and there but the filipinos they 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 cover themselves they don't want to get too much oh, sun. yeah too tan yeah you you can see you know the guy like the tricycle drivers they they work outdoors all all day long as all their work is outdoors so they get dark so they cover up but they're already dark yeah <laughs> so they don't want to get they don't want to get charcoal Darker. they don't want to get charcoal because the sun can cause problems um if you're if you're a black person, you're not necessarily in the sun all the time. It just happened in in the in in your ancient history. So um, you're born with darker skin, but you don't always want to stay out in the sun. It's not good for you. A little bit of sun is good for you, but too much sun is not good for you. Correct. Because in the old in the ancient days, the what, during the Roman Empire, the death sentence was to hang on the cross uh, and mm. burn to death from the sun. Oh, that's so you you know when you sit out in the house for right. like, like lens on you, you gotta like sweat it away, right? You can't do that on the cross. You you it sucks to be you. Mm-hmm. Not good. They, they kill you for disagreeing with them. Like J. I Mike, know. J. Mike would have been would have been killed on the cross a long time ago. <laughs> oh, yeah. But you know what? Those people were, you know, they believed that they were right. It's it's astonishing how how we're arguing what what is the truth. <laughs> it's, it's astonishing to me. Uh, Crazy. It is officially oh, it is officially three hours, and it's time for it is, yeah. We gotta say goodbye right there. And say go goodbye to... so long. I thought tomorrow J Mike is live. Yeah, tomorrow uh, same time I'm live. Where's that link? Uh, you got a link? I had one. Everybody tam sack that. I don't know what I went to. Shadow, what am I up to? 92? You're in the 90s. Where's my Maybe channel? 93. Where's my channel? Here it is. I'm there. Give me a second, guys. Please thumbs up. What it, guys? <laughs> Copy that. Go here. <coughs> thumbs up, guys. Oh, I need a new computer. Definitely. Thumbs, thumbs up that live. That's tomorrow's live right there, guys. Please give that a thumbs up, and uh, we'll see you again same time tomorrow. We got 84. That's not a bad number. Yeah, we we were a little under 100 um, yesterday. Not too. bad. We were, um, let's see what we had. I forgot what. It was in the, I think it was 90 or something. Hold on. We have 92. Hold on. There you go. It was, it I'm was. I'm 10 sack yet now, Jay. 86. I thought it was higher than that, but it might have gone down. I don't know. I don't know. We, but we only stayed, well, four hours, 86 thumbs up. Monday, you know, Sunday night over there. Take a seat. See, Darren, we're doing the same thing over and over, expecting different results. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Well, you know what the thing is? We're not going as many hours now. We, we, we're shortening it a little bit. That's that's another factor. Because if we stay live, like, for another two hours, we'll have another group of people coming in, and we'll be over 100. That's right. But I have to go to work tomorrow. All right. Yeah, let's get going, guys. I'll see you. I'm going to leave right now. See you guys. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye, everybody. 93. Excellent. Thanks for coming, everybody. Thank you, Linda Lou. Thank you, Sherry Anna. Sherry Anna. uh, Tammy Trot. uh, um, Putt Putt King. Sean Williams. Everybody. Sweet Dreams. Thank you for everything on Panay Vlogs. Uh, Francis Ting. Thank you, guys. Uh, um, Shadow Darren. See you guys later. And I, but but I'll start playing your, uh, start playing your videos now, but but. God bless. Thank you so much. 
Woo-hoo. Take care, later. Darren. God bless. Yeah, see you. See you tomorrow.